14 months baby let's go also even though you are no longer sponsored by G Fuel if you were to make a flavor it should be called by Smoothie Blast or something should be called what? The Smoothie Blast <laughs> Quick Sparse did you auto update this? Thanks Iron Eagle for 14 months Thanks Cusick Thank you Video Waved for 15 months The guy changed my username from Video Player and all my friends forgot to get on Any suggestions on what to do? You just have to shake them and yell I'm not him I'm me I'm Video Player Hi Fire Billy Thank you for the 18 months Thank you Andy the Dogs for the Prime Thank you Cruppy Boy for the Prime Thank you Ian K for the 14 months Thank you so much, Ian. Hi, everybody. What's up? Yeah, look. Look, normally, month I think you guys... I wanted to let you know that I would not have even subbed in the first place if you didn't gift me my first month way back when during GTA 5. So you're saying Here's it was an investment. 18 more months of guilting more people into subbing to your channel. Um... All right, so you're saying, I noticed today that I've gifted over a 1,000 subs. So you're saying it was all part of my strategy. Uh, Jerma985 is my favorite streamer. He is fucking phenomenal. Uh, just the most months, entertaining person ever. Crap. Even don't though I generally would, if you guys are on my channel, I don't normally tell you to not watch me. Uh, but he's doing a dollhouse stream where the viewers get to decide. It, I'm not even clear what it is. I'm gonna watch this after stream. Jimmer's dollhouse stream. I'm so mad that you are. I know. Sorry, Oreo. Today's look. I've been sick for like since my last stream. I was like sick on my last stream, and I've been sick since then. Wow. And so today's the first day I feel good. So I wanted to stream today, but unfortunately, it's during Jerma's dollhouse stream. But he's doing it for two more streams. Anyways, you should consider watching Jerma instead of me. But hi, everybody. What's up? Yo, Soda, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Today we'll be doing some Skyrim. I think it'll be fun. Um, and hello. It feels quiet. It's just this quiet music? Is this music quiet or is the whole stream quiet? No, okay. No, we're good. Uh, hi everybody. What's up? Uh, Churchinimo, thank you for the, uh, did I say 22 months? My god. All right, we'll start. In, uh, we'll start in just a minute. Yes, I am Boo. Damn right. Thank you for the sub. All right, y'all. Second stream. Hello, welcome back. I got switch today. Why is this school theme? We're learning. Got to switch today. I'm playing Mario Odyssey. Good. This has always been a learning stream. We come here to learn how to play video games better. That's always been the premise. That's true, scum. You can watch me and Jerma. Um, okay, some quick quick updates. Her Matata, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. My god, that is extremely generous. Some quick updates. If you were here on uh, the previous stream, um, there was somewhat of a revolution during the Minecraft stream where a fraction of my viewers protested my treatment of them as the royalty of this channel and went and created new new Doug Doug and formed their own society. Uh, fortunately, uh, we got them banned. So uh, we did it. New new Doug Doug is officially banned off of Twitch for impersonation. And um, according to the official new new Doug Doug press release. Thanks, Ice Frout. Uh, they seem to be pretty happy about it. We did, in fact, shut down their Twitch colony. What's and they seem to be done? some sort of philosophical thing, but it's never going to matter. We crushed them like an ant. Oh. I win. Uh, that's the first good news. We've officially crushed the revolution. Princess Doug Doug lives forever. Um... And just, you know, for anybody else who's considering uh, revolutionary, let this be a warning. The second update before we get to Skyrim is Rose of the Sea Otter's birthday is coming up. I've been struggling with my mental health lately, so thank you for making me smile with your streams. You're welcome, Chris. Rose's birthday is coming up. As a reminder, she was born on the day of our Lord, the 26th of August, 1999. So... Um, here's their address. This is at dugdug.com slash Rosa, by the way. 
Uh, Rosa erupted from her mother's vagina, ready to shock the world with love and cuteness. Um, she's the oldest otter at the Monterey Bay Aquarium. I mean, several of us were worried she would die, but she's still going. She's Rosa. She's unstoppable. She's literally, the otters are supposed to live till they're 20. She's turning 22. What a badass. Um, and look at this. She's reared more pups than any other surrogate mother on exhibit. Incredible. Rosa is literally immortal. Literally. Uh, and her birthday is in eight days. Thanks for the streams, Doug. You are my favorite streamer. Thank you, Third Fist. Thank you for the support. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god. You should not watch me or Germa. You should just look at this all day. You should watch this on loop. Look at that. Are they humping? No. No, they're just cute or something. They're, she's surrogating. That's She's a surrogate mother. She was mothering. Don't worry. Anyways, uh, Rosa's birthday's coming up on the 26th. Um, we've That's made a documentary about this before. Year one, we gave $3,200 or $320. Year two, we raised $2,600. I'll be matching uh, donations this year as well. Uh, and it should You're be on the, the 26th. Best. Unless something like crazy happens, we should be doing the stream on her birthday, the 26th. And, um, and it's going to be great. I'm really excited for it. I have a fear Rosa will die. Rosa is literally immortal. Don't say that. Um, there's also, we'll be showing art on the birthday stream. As part of the birthday stream, if you would like to show your love for Rosa, you can submit your artwork to dugdug.com slash for Rosa. Submit your fan art here and uh, we'll review it on the birthday stream and pick um, the most beloved Rosa fan art. And maybe we'll like tweet that at Monterey Bay Aquarium with the donation or something. I don't know what, there's not necessarily something that you win, but it's more just to appreciate Rosa. So if you want to participate in the Rosa art contest, go to dugdog.com slash for Rosa and you could win Rosa's love and appreciation. All right, anything else? We're good for Skyrim? Can we submit more than one? Sure, yeah. I'm sorry, teacher. I won't be able to attend. I have another birthday that day. Unacceptable. Unless it's for a different sea mammal who is older than Rosa. Okay, that is only acceptable if the person whose birthday it is is older than Rosa. Otherwise, uh, seniority rights. I got you, Shiny. Um... Yeah, I think they were good, right? Hi, Doug. How are you doing? Have to use my drawing skills? D, this is a compliment, I think. Thank you. I appreciate it. Tomorrow my bird turns two. Nope, doesn't count. Too low. 22 months to two. Doug, Doug, two ducks. Perhaps a sign either way Pepsi is better than Coke. Not true. You're fired. Can we submit music? Nice being I... able to catch a stream yes. again. Yes, although ideally it's somehow... Well, music somehow rosa related yeah no nudes i'm not we're not doing any nudes i guess every picture of rosa is a nude i guess yeah. i guess every single yeah i guess technically nudes are fine but you know what i mean um all right should we skyrim what if that gets hit by a mud crab or something and it spawns all three then we'll have to deal with it. Look, that's what today's about. We're going to figure this out. Uh, no, Jarker, I haven't. I have been sick. Please allocate my sub money into Rose's birthday fund. Thank you. Uh, why don't you just wait to... Uh, well, I guess it's too late now. All Any donations on the 26th will go towards Rose's birthday. Yeah, no furry art. No, 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 no. Is no. the best professor in the prestigious academy? I don't think so. Um... But he's he's the best. Derma's the fucking goat. He's so good. Uh, oh, shit, I was going to say something. Oh, yeah, the apology video. I'm literally now, I don't know how many days. I'm like over a month late on the apology video. It's just been, this month has just been bad. I keep getting sick or things keep coming up. It's just been uh, a mess. So I apologize about hey, not Dick, apologizing sooner. During the DK stream last month, and now I have to keep subscribed. To no, no, no. I, I have the list. I downloaded the list of subscribers during the Donkey Kong stream. So, and I've been waiting every week. I'm like, okay, I'll have a day. I'll be able to do this. And then that day never happens. So maybe this week, but hopefully soon. I have to apologize because I started a challenge and I said that if I gave up on the challenge. Force. I feel 18 thank months you, Lasko, So this is totally working. 
if I quit on the challenge, I had to make an apology video to every single one of my subs. Fit apology finders, apology finders, apology finders. Okay, let's, um, I think it's time. Let's get into the meat and potatoes of today's stream, All right? Where are you guys? Oh, there you are. <clears throat> As we all know, <clears throat> we come here to this stream to learn. And that learning continues right now. Welcome back to Lessons in Sneakery. This is the Skyrim series in the Doug Doug Graduate School of Skyrimology. Get out your notebooks. Okay, today we're answering a question I've wanted to know for a while. Today's lesson, can you beat the Thieves Guild in Skyrim if a random enemy spawns every time you're hit? Let me demonstrate. All right, so let's say you're in the middle of White Run. So if I'm in the middle of White Run here, and I walk up to, Not let's say, check. Lilith, and then she hits me. And then she hits me. Every single hit, every time that I am hit, a new random enemy will spawn into the open. And it could be anything. Could be a dragon, a mammoth, a skeleton. We don't know if they're going to attack me. We don't know if they're going to attack anybody else. But every hit spawns a new one. Now. <clears throat> My proposal... My hypothesis for this challenge, spawning random enemies per hit could improve stealth-based gameplay. You might be asking, what the fuck are you talking about, Doug? Well, number one, if I'm discovered by enemies while stealthing, random units could provide a distraction for me to escape, right? Second hypothesis, if I encounter difficult enemies, I can spawn units to fight them instead. I don't have to engage with anybody. To test this, we're going to start a new file. We're going to start the Thieves Guild questline, which is all sneaky missions. And then I have to beat three self missions with these new tactics. The question is, can I defeat all three missions with this mod active? And does it help me? And then, in an additional part of our research methodology, I have to beat one stealth mission without attacking anyone. Is this... Is this mod so beneficial for stealth methodology that I don't even need to attack? That I don't need to attack anybody? Could I beat a whole mission by just having the spawned units fight for me? And if that is true, I think we can conclude that this mod dramatically improves sneakery in Skyrim. Any questions? What if you spawn enemies that... Hold on. What if you spawn enemies that are on the side of the enemies? Uh, I could change it to that, but it feels like that is cheating, sort of. Causing a huge chain reaction could be a problem. Yes, one of the one of the potential issues, very much so, is that the the enemies there's so many of them spawn that it gets way out of hand really fast. Where do babies come from? Uh, Nazim, can Nazim spawn? I could make Nazim spawn, but that's kind of boring. Because then he's not going to attack me. I could have Nazim spawn. He's not technically an enemy. We could have Nazim spawn. We could vote on it. Maybe we... Okay. Maybe if it becomes too hard, later on, we change it so Nazim can spawn. Well, actually, I might have that right now. Okay. More more quick learning. Here's how the... Um, here's how it's actually set up. Uh, it's pretty simple. So this... This script, this uh, is on the player. This is where this code is. And then this, you can see it's an event on hit. So every time, every time the player is hit, 
this code happens. Uh, and all I'm gonna do when I'm hit is I tell my main code to spawn a random unit. Um, let's see, we're spawning. Okay, so these are the random units that it could actually spawn. So this function um, creates an array and randomly picks from it. So uh, chicken, dog, cow, goat, horse, rabbit, mud crab. There's three different sizes of mud crabs. And yes, they are Mr. Krabs. Horker, bear, charis, snow bear, wolf, ice wolf, saber cat, snowy saber cat, skeever, ice wraith, werewolf, troll, frost troll, mammoth, dra dragon, draugr, restless draugr, draugr, overlord, dwarven sphere, frostbite spider, giant, hagraven, shade, skeleton, skeleton archer, skeleton mage, spriggan, wisp, and nazim. I don't know... If we do Nazim, I don't think we. I don't think we do Nazim. We need a giant. We. What are you talking about? God, have you been paying any attention to my classroom? Why don't I take out Nazim for now and we add him in? Right. We have our hypotheses. As this stream progresses, we can update my hypothesis with new information. Giant Nazim can do that. I guess. Nazim is an the the problem the problem is that Nazim does not fight me he does not fight me, which is an issue, because then it, it's not actually like harming me at all if a Nazim spawns. Alduin I don't think works. I because I tried spawning other guys and there was lots of issues. Turns out, like Skyrim does not like this at all. Sky Nazim fights you though. Give Nazim a sword. I might be able to, if it's, if we spawn Nazim, then, <laughs> like, if we spawn Nazim, then we frenzy him. Is that doable? Has anybody here made Skyrim mods? Can you, like, force an NPC to attack you? Because then that works. Then if we're spawning Santa Nazim anywhere, that could be fun. Cheese is not an enemy. I like where your guys' head's at, but not an enemy. The chat has chosen. Yeah, but... Hi, Cherry. It's been a while. Long time. Okay, we'll do a poll. The train mod is on. I don't think it is. Jesus, take the wheel. No, it isn't. Hermitata, thank you again for the 10 gifted subs. Really appreciate it. Uh, I know I'm missing a bunch of subs. Thank you, everybody, for subbing. I appreciate it very much. Uh, do we have Nazim? I don't know how to make him angry. Eight months, holy crap. Started Thanks, watching you during the Capitol riots while I had COVID. Thanks for lifting my spirits that day and every day. Hope you are feeling better. 20 months. Can't believe it's been this long. Hey, thanks, Delta. Cheese? No, we're not doing cheese. Cheese is not an enemy. Okay, Nazim, I'm just gonna I'm gonna be Princess Dug Dug and override all of your wills with my skipping my actual lecture for uh, this lesson. Look, I've got a fancy new PowerPoint. This is basically a real classroom now. Uh, we'll add Nazim if I come in if I run into issues hey, later. Love your stuff. This Happy this is a an addition that we will we will introduce midway through. Thank you, Connor, friend. Right? We have our freaking we have my my current hypothesis, okay? Doug hi. The revolution will prevail. No, the revolution was permaban. We have my current hypothesis. I want to specifically test these two ideas. When discovered random units provide a distraction. It's like a smoke Be bomb, okay? Dunks. It's like a like if if I'm sneaking around, right? I'm I'm practicing full sneakery with my bow and then somebody sees me and shoots me with a bow, right? Enemies poof out of me like a smoke bomb and then I book it out of there. This is a brilliant strategy, and Nazim would ruin that. Because then he wouldn't attack the Wait, no, he would attack the enemies. Well, look, we'll do these two. We'll do my me research methodology of beating three stealth missions with we new tactics, and then we'll, we'll add Nazim on the third one, okay? You aren't a real teacher, are you? Technically, yes. Also, Amazing. what does real even mean, dude? Um... So this is the plan. Three stealth missions normally, one stealth mission without attacking. I think this will be crazy, and it could probably work.
Tell you what, I'll look, I'll let you vote, and then ignore it. No, my idea is way better. Yeah. We've got to progress up. We can't, you can't just start full Nazim. You're going to prematurely Nazimulate. Jesus, take the wheel. Also, a guy reached out to me for a sponsorship. Let me pull it up on my other monitor so you can't see it. A guy pull a guy reached out to me for like an actual person reached out to a spot reached out to me for a sponsorship and his real name is Nazim. And I was just staring at this being like, this has to be a joke, right? This has to be a joke. There's no way a person. So I was like, cause a bunch of people emailed me with fake job offers after the, the LinkedIn video. Again, and so I was like, this is probably, chaos. there's a lot of people who sent me like legitimate sounding job offers. Can I pull it up? Wait, where is it? Oh, oh here it is. Okay. I don't want to... Three months, I, I, yeah, I don't want to show his name. Go, sir. Okay. And then I finally, like, the after, like, a minute, straight minute yes. of looking at this email, I finally looked at it and realized his name is Naeem. But I like I've got Nazim on my brain, and so I was just looking at this and being like, "No, there's not, there's not a person named Nazim in the planet." So anyway, so oh, that's a horrible mix of my. All right, we'll add Nazim later. We'll add Nazim later. Thank you, Leggy. Leggy. Birthday, Rosa. Happy twelve months. Um. All right, cool. Everybody ready? Let's do it. Viva Laro's evolution. Uh. Do I need anything else? Yeah, we have to start a new file anyway. Do we add Naeem? <laughs> we could add Naeem. Oh, we could add Naeem. Um, I could just start... Do I need to start a new file? I could just use this character, who's like level one. Nah, Apologies we should probably start a new file. Playing finders while wearing a made outfit. Do you guys want to watch... Apology finders, apology finders, apology finders. Thanks, Noel. Uh, do you want to watch the Skyrim intro for like the 800th time on Most this stream? My beloved. The good news is I've been learning how to speedrun, so I can show you how to speedrun the beginning. It is tradition, that's true. Uh, also, nice. let me quickly... At every hit... Please hold. This is far too loud of music for Sorry, just sitting here. My wife divorced me after I opposed the rebellion, but don't worry, I got a trumpet. I watched all the VODs love the content. <laughs> Thank you, man. Uh, happy to, or sorry to hear about your divorce. Alright, let's play Skyrim. I, this is not, I'm not saying this I booked ironically. Rose's birthday off work just so I could drink and celebrate with you. Nice, It'll Josh. be there for the whole stream, my dude. Okay. Brand new file. We're starting a brand new file. Um, I, my, I would, perp I would hypothesize that I have spent more time watching the intro of Skyrim than playing Skyrim on yes. this stream. Rosa's birthday party was the first vid I watched of yours. Rosa is queen. Like there are, there's been at least three or four streams. Wait, wait. Get ready. Hey, hey, you, you, you're finally hey, awake. Rosa, we love you. You. I, there's been at least the like three right? streams Long where it has been legitimately the entirely the Skyrim the intro. Over there. Damn you, Stormcloaks! Skyrim was Dead fine talk. until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. Oh, got it, Quicksparse. Thank you. All right, later. There's code uh, from Quicksparse from a viewer. 
uh, to make Nazim angry. Happy to see another you stream. You and Hope me. you're doing Shouldn't awesome. Be here. Hey, thanks for Super Mega Bonnie. He said the thing. Uh, yeah. So good news. I've been. I'm trying to learn Except how to speed run Skyrim. Ready I'm not very good at it yet, but I do know how to get today. to Riften really fast. So I'll get us to Riften really fucking fast. I'm excited. It'll probably take longer than just... You're not good at speedrunning? Cherry, I have literally... <laughs> I have literally beaten you. Like 20 or 30 minutes of my entire life have been spent waiting for you to finish your speedrun. Just sitting there, like tapping my foot, trying to kill time, checking my watch while you sit on the final boss. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? Are you able to do the early tutorial escape? Yes. Should leave home. Excited for the Skyrim Orsted. today, good sir. I'm, Here's my question for the stream. What color is a mirror? Doug. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Okay, so again, the goal, we're gonna make a new file, make a new character, get out of Helgen Keep, and then I'm going to rift in immediately so we can start the Thieves Guild. Please help me. Make your character Naeem. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll name him Naeem. I hope Naeem is not watching Look, this stream right now. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. Oh, yeah, I do have but the My Little Pony mod on still. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Are you learning new languages? What? What do you mean? I hope Naeem is watching this stream. I don't get it, Brendan. Oh, because of the months. I get it. Thanks, Brendan. Look, there's a lot of children that I've birthed. Hi, E-Dog. I speak fluent JavaScript. Nice. First stream only watch YouTube. What's up, Gordy? Welcome. Streams are there's something. Can we name our character? I feel like we're in agreement, right? We're naming our character Naeem. Farm on the Minecraft server got sidetracked by how fun split gators. Played it? Uh, I've not. I haven't played much stuff. Okay, we're naming him Naeem. Sixteen down months. Let's go. Who? Who is the sneakiest? What what race? Face your death with some courage. Red guard? You've got to tell oh yeah, we probably should be red guard. This is a Finally a stream of yours during my vacation. Now let's try to stay awake during it. Greetings <laughs> from Germany. Hey, thank you. I appreciate it. 16 months is a long time, so here's a fun fact. Gary Newman is 13 days older than Gary Oldman. <laughs> that is fun. Alright, we're making this thing. Uh, we'll hey, Zach, I love your YouTube. Whoa. First time I've been able to catch a stream. Hey, thanks, Milyak. I mean, next ten minutes are uh, boring. Next ten minutes are me just playing the video game normally, which uh, is unusual. So don't get used to it. Cats that people can lick you. Cats are quiet. Step forward. Who are you? Who are you? Uh, okay. Does anybody care? What what are we? We got elves, lizard, ver varieties of humans, cat, orc, redguard, which is what Nazim is, wood elf, quick pull. 14. Thank you. The sink. Appreciate it. What is cat, lizard, red guard, uh, Nord, elf? I'll just pick a random elf. All right, I feel like we're gonna land on cat. We always land on cat, but this is actually, I feel like, thematically appropriate. Sorry, I'm late. Unacceptable. The tension. Don't let it happen again. I've never arrived late to this stream. I expect my viewers not to either. All right, congratulations. We're going to be a cat for the 50th time. We are halfway there. I mean, this this makes sense though, right? They make excellent thieves due to their natural stealthiness. We this absolutely we should be a cat this time. Naim. 
I'm a YouTube frog and this is my first time watching the stream. Hey, welcome, Chill. Happy to have you here. Make it look more fucked up, but I want to get to the actual gameplay. I just don't care very much. Jesus, take the wheel. Can you even make the cats that fucked up? Nose height. I'll just do all the sliders to the right. Since the Royal Professor Doug gave me my first sub to his channel due to Donkey Kong, it seems only fair that I offer a feudal lord a prime sub. Laugh lines, cheek. This is okay. This is all color. It doesn't even. It just looks like a a unneutered cat now. Yeah, you can't really you can't really screw up a cat that much. I don't think. Oh, never mind. Oh, <laughs> now that is stealthy. Why does my hair include the, wheel. the rings? All right. Naim. Cool. We've got a punk rocker cat named Naim. Easy, you got this. You with one of the trade caravans, Kajit. Thanks, Akusic. Well, I, I mean, I, I presented my hypothesis. I think that this mod will make stealth missions easier. I genuinely think that is true. I don't know that I got this so much as whether that hypothesis is going to turn out to be true or not. Follow the captain prisoner. Change it to Naim. Nah, we got to be faithful to Naim. I cool. have a question. Yo. Thanks, cats. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a nah him. voice to murder his kid. Mayo Boy's cousin. They're all they're all cousins, yeah. You started this war. Skyrim, you have to fight Nazim with your fist whenever he spawns, no matter the situation. The issue with that is he would get like 10 hits off. You need to make this a video and get it sponsored by Naeem. That's a good idea. So I won't reply to his initial email until we've edited the video. And then I'm like, look, man, I made a whole stream based on you. I'll give you one choice to sponsor me. Thanks, After. After Hour. Um. <clears throat> Cool. So I'm gonna do the the speed run thing to get out of the intro really fast. So I'm gonna jump into that tower over there and then jump onto the walls up there, and then I'm gonna do a skip where you it's like a load warp where you warp with the load out of to a different thing. I don't get to see my children anymore, but at least I have your magnificent and beautiful figure to gaze upon. Oof. Well, nothing that some Skyrim modding can't help with. This is starting to drag on. Next, the cat. I have a good idea for another, like, if I say dragon kind of video. Did you hear that? Basically, here, I'll just say it. effects spawn an enemy each second? Oh, shit. Probably, yeah. Flames might do that, too. Oh, if I get set on fire, because fire hits you constantly, that'll spawn a lot of enemies. That would be bad. <laughs> I think I want to do, like, the if I say dragon what thing. What if they spawn whenever you hit anyone as well? To encourage even more stealth. Jesus Christ. Yeah, we can add that later. Remind me to add that later on. Um, I want to do the if I say dragon thing, but like instead of spawning enemies, it just like <laughs> like if I say if you get me to say the word quit, it just it instantly alt f fours the game. If it, if you get me to say crash, it'll spawn uh, like a thousand dragons, so it just instantly crashes the game. So just by you like just turning the game off, which I feel like uh, could be infuriating. Teacher, can I be excused for the rest of the year? I'm not learning enough. JK loves the content. Thanks, Shark. Detention. T before before that, I want to learn how to speedrun, though. Like, the full game. Because I feel like that would be fun for speedrunning. Cheese. Thanks, Noofy. Alright. Watch in oblivion. You know what? I'm going to play some Bayonetta music. Love you, buddy. Have a good day. All right, time to reveal the very first speed run. Oh, I got hit. Uh oh, I did not was not expecting that. Okay, so there's enemies. I saw a goat. Okay, the intro's gonna be a little screwed up, but I <laughs> he killed Rayloft. Oh my God, this is 
I think we're fine. Alright, and now I do my skip. And uh and we'll just go this way and ignore all that shit. Oh shit. <laughs> no! Oh dude! This is where. Fuck. This is where. Oh. Rayloff is supposed to be here to unbind my hands. But yep. he's dead because. <laughs> shit, we have to watch the intro again. Fuck! <laughs> no! That's so bad! Oh. Is there an autosave? Thank you, Omeal. Oh, oh, here. Okay, no we got a one year. Let's go. Happy birthday to Rosa oh. in ten days. Let's go. Um, we got a. <laughs> it was the goat. <laughs> Is this gonna happen again? I might need to turn off. Eh, whatever. Let's see if it happens again. We'll try it one more time. It, but if this does happen again, if it kills Rayloff. Then I need to turn Why the mod off it until the intro is done. The cold food out, hot eat the food. <sighs> That's tr true, man. That's deep. Ulfric Stormcloak. Go through the other door, can ha Some so Hadmar can do it. Call you a hero. Yeah, but I guess I can do that. Like Lagro, thank you for the twelve months. That would be cheating. So, yeah, I'll quick save before before Alduin. And restore the peace. Nazim or Riot. We'll add him later. It's nothing. Yeah, I mean Carry we on. can avoid it if I yes, if it spawns buddies. a goat. Give them their last rights. Spawning a troll is bad. As we commend your souls to if you're lactose intolerant, then cheese the is the enemy. For the love I've been cows, eating a lot more cheese. Let's get this over. Learn. I don't like it. As you wish. Who is Naeem? He's a guy who wants to sponsor me. Thirteen months of cheese. Uh, yeah, the slack attack. I could make him invincible. That's true. Uh, it's just it feels boring to me. Or I let me rephrase that. I like to change as few things as possible. I like the idea that the game is mostly functioning normally, and then I've changed one thing, and that to me is like more interesting than changing a lot of different elements of the game. So hopefully we can do it without needing to make him invincible. All right, so as long as I don't it is again. get hit is and spawn something if you here, we're fine. To the Next. Lord, she's can totally be an prisoner. enemy. To the block prisoner, nice and easy. And I will quick save here. Oh, but I have to quick save again later. Ah, eh, we'll be fine. Let's go. Let's go. Let's hit up the music, and hopefully, Rayloff and Hadvar don't die. Wait, too early. Sentries. What do you see? Love the new vid, good luck today. Thanks, Bordy. Okay, take two. Here we go. Okay, I hear Mr. Krabs. But I don't think Mr. Krabs will kill Rayloff. Oh, and there's a dog. I think the dog will kill Mr. Krabs. We're fine. Uh, okay, we're good. Mr. Krabs is dead. I, need, I should reiterate, I'm really new at speedrunning. There we go. Uh, okay, now hopefully he's here. He needs to be here to cut my hands. Here we go. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. And then I bump him. What's that? We should keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. Okay. Cool. There you go. Take a look around. There should be plenty. Get. Choose. Now I save this. I go back to my quick save. 
Now I'm up here from earlier. Now I run down here. And then I'm going to do a thing where I pause while I'm changing loading zones and then load the previous file, the which will American boot that previous field. file out here. So now I go here and I have to stand at a very precise spot. That looks correct. Okay. So I opened the menu. Oh, I missed it. So I have to open the menu while the game is loading. Shit. The ten eating video proves that cheese is the enemy. Oh shit, I can't get it. I was getting it first try the other day. Hold on. We need music, sure. No, it's too close. One sec. There we go. Okay, I've exited to the main menu. Now I can load the previous file that I had where Hadvar unbound my hands. Now I'm in that place I just tried to load into. I go back out into the open world. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm in Skyrim. Let's go. Cool, and now I can warp back here. Please teach me how to speed run the intro teacher teacher duke duck dad dad. Dad Six Damn minutes it. duke duck hog hog. Okay, there we go. Uh and now I'm gonna fly on a horse and we're gonna fly all the way to Riften. Your green screen is cancer. Oh yeah, it does. That should do it. This seems like it is going to drag on. Oh wait, wrong challenge. No, nah, you're probably right. Oh no. Pinkie Pie. You picked up that time to get lost, right? This is a surprise. Professor Dr. Douglasine didn't bring enough gum to share with the class. Can you please make him share? Just to have some of that his ass gum. Alright, uh now. What I'm gonna do is I could set a load up Rose's here. Birthday was on the 28th. No, that's when they had the birthday party. I come up here, I set a file. Wait, no, no, I had to. Hold on, I'm learning. Hey, man, let it be in source. Also, keep up the great work. So now I, I made a save up there. No, too early. Hold on. Now I steal this horse. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Are you little filcher? What? Oh, I got hit. I didn't think about that. Uh-oh. I might not be able to do this strategy. Oh, god damn it. Hold on. I keep doing this music too early. We're almost there. I'm gonna start flying in a second. Get on. Come on. These horses. This is why I don't watch My Little Pony. What is happening? Why won't the horse go on? This is the worst Tell horse I've ever- I love you for oh my Hold on. Or who is this? Applejack or- Whichever My Little Pony this is, is the worst one. Okay, there we go. How does Dot get calculated with your mod? Will you just spawn everything at once if on fire? Sorry, I missed that. Okay, so now when I move back to this old file, Fluttershy, sorry. When I move to this file, uh, all the speed that I just Mr. built from Mr. flying Mr. off this horse Mr. will be applied to me. Okay, so now I'm flying across the mountain. Um, okay, cool, and we're at High Hrothgar. <laughs> oh shit! Um, I went a little fast. I'm still learning. Hi Doug, hope you are doing well. Random question, has there been any interesting bloopers slash behind the scenes stories when filming or explained with food videos? Uh, not really that I can think of. Alright, hold on. Take two, take two, take two. Here, let me play the band out of music. That was, that got me in the better mindset. So I'm going to go up to High Hrothgar and then I'm going to fly from High Hrothgar to Riften. Um, 
It'll be fine. The sneakiest they can get to the cloud district every single day. That should be good. Oh wait, I don't need to go to High Hrothgar. Yo, Bro Bicagra, thank you so much. Bro Bicagra. Thank you for the 10 gifted, man. I appreciate it very much. Alright. Wait, this is too far. Eh, I'm still learning speedrunning. We'll figure it out in the future. Um... Technically, I didn't go far enough. I'm supposed to go all the way to High Harothgar. Whoa. Eh, we'll just fly. We'll be fine. Okay, now I set my save here, and then I have to go roughly around the mountain. We'll be, let me see if this works. This Big is in a way your worse YouTube position. Channel. Your videos never fail to make to me laugh. Glad I finally caught your stream live. I hey, think it's purple. Okay. Um. Time to quickly test this delivery service. Okay, that's pretty fast. This might be too fast. Depending on how far he is from the horse, that's how fast he'll go. So just what? Oh, oops. Dug is streaming. Do you know about the city of Nazim? <laughs> no. Hide a guy love you. That should be good. Thanks, Tien. And beautiful. And now we Okay, I went oh. <laughs> the wrong direction. So I was supposed to go from here to here. Maybe I should just take a carriage. I don't think this is actually helping. <laughs> I'm very Going very out far off course. See you Monday. Where even, where is it? You can drop Madis' ring and tell Grinjar if you lost it still completes the quest. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna take a carriage. Three more tries. Then I'm gonna take a carriage. Jesus, take the wheel. All I have to do is get to Riften, by the way. It's literally just starting the Thieves Guild. And hail my meat, thank you very much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that. That'll be fast. Okay, this is temp one. Okay, perfect. Now I, I turn left. And now I head for the lake. <laughs> I should. Alright. Uh, no. As you can probably tell, this is mostly an excuse. Don't get hit to practice the speedrunning stuff. It's actually really, really fun, but I'm not doing it very well right now. That'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Skyrim fact, this game was pitched to Todd Howard by the legend himself, Shiggy Mario McGee. Oh my god, there's Rift and Lake. Okay, I'm over the lake, I'm over the lake. I just have to not die. Oh my god. Ho! Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! Let's go! And see, that's how you quickly get from the intro to Riften. Let's see. It. That gets my birthday and they'll do a favor and can't you streaming as your present to me so you're good. Next year though. Also, this made my day thanks, Doug. Yeah, I got you. Alright. We are at Riften. Now we'll start the Thieves Guild questline and actually test this mod. Hold there. 
Yeah, yeah, Before yeah. Before yeah. I let you into Riftum, you need to pay the visitors' tax. Happy birthday, Rissa. Of entering the city. Right. Keep your voice down. No, you're too early, Ty. Everyone to hear you. It's in a week. No, it's in Just eight days. Let me unlock the gate. Hey. Alrighty. Gates unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. A lot of people in Santa outfits. <clears throat> Why is the city gate so short? Is that short for a door? What do you mean? What do you mean this? These both feel fine. I don't know what you're... I don't know you. You and Riften looking no, don't care. You could pretend not to hear me all you want. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. All right. When you borrowed the money, you said the gate itself is it short? I guess. It's just like it's like a door. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? All right. Running a little light in the pockets, lad. This is the start of the thieves guild. Pockets, lad. So it begins at vampires and hawkers. Get a little low on coin. Uh, the first mission doesn't really count, right? I don't have to, like, fight anything. It's all about sizing up your mark, well, Let's play some stealth music. The way they walk, what they're wearing. Going out to the second it's best doctor giveaway. see you Monday. Battle of voice. Is it Monday? Why are you saying see you Monday? What is on Monday? What is on Monday? Why do people keep talking about Monday? Sorry for noise, but that's a year, baby. Hey, thank you for the year. My wealth is none of your business. That's where you're wrong, lad. Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. It's Monday. Today is not Monday, and nothing is happening on Monday. I don't know what you. I've got a bit of an errand to perform. But I need an extra like your cheesy versus Skyrim video, you can do it with salt this time. One hands, teaspoon of salt with well ten salt piles. What? Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're Today, to steal Monday hype. Silver ring from the strong box under the stand. Once you when? have it, I want you when to did this love for Monday happen? I don't understand at all. Noticing. I'm the biggest Skyrim streamer right now. Fuck yeah. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you it's tell Monday, 7-11. We'll get started. It's August. What are you talking about? Good. Wait until I start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Okay, I just have to go get the ring, everyone, right? Everyone, gather round. I have uh, something amazing to show you that demands your attention. No pushing, no shoving. Plenty don't I have room. to? Shit, I don't remember how to crouch. I changed all my buttons. This way, everyone. Over here. Don't I have to? I have to. Where do I steal from? Let's school. What is it? For here. glorious months, may you stash into a test of time. Is a rare opportunity. Uh oh. I wouldn't want you to get left out. That's what you said about the. It's in his pocket. And it no, I thought I have to steal it. damage activate the creature spawn. Well, that was a simple. Oh, oh, right, right, right. But this item is the real thing. Wait, what? I thought I no, I put it in his pocket, right? Lads and lasses, I give you. Balma blood elixir. What do I have to? I wasn't paying attention at all. What do I have to do? The one and only. Mystical beings who live in legends and were masters of great magic. Marker. Oh yeah, good good point. How did you? That then. No one seen Fun fact: Sharks didn't know that My camels exist. Well, I don't have lockpicks, so <laughs> cool. <laughs> this is very cool. Two years is slowly coming upon us. Don't want to teach my first class next semester, but I think your stream will help me teach intro to stats. Good. We're learning a lot of stats. I just got to hear what's going on. Also, I'm still waiting on that apology. You'd have picks if you didn't skip the intro. I saved so much time by speedrunning, okay? Probably at least a minute or two. Four months and I've learned everything except calculus, so that's still everything in the universe. Uh, true. Is there, like, a lockpick somewhere that I can have? 
Yes. I have no money and Jesus no items. Take the wheel. All right, we've got a potato. <laughs> Can I sell that? Can I trade somebody for like a, for a lockpick? Or... Runs dead. It's not a speed run. Can this just be over? How long is this? How long is this going for? Here. Sky in fact, something something dragon born. Okay now it's time to get into Shiggy Miggy facts. Why you? <laughs> oh shit, he caught me putting potatoes into his <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> shit! We're, okay, this is fine. As long as I'm very stealthy. So my hypothesis is I can get out of a sticky situation if somebody's attacking me, right? All I have to do is cause a distraction and leave. Yeah, see, we're fine now. You should do some Skyrim speedrunning streams sometime. This is actually sick. It's not actually sick yet because I haven't learned it yet. But I think it'll be fun once I'm decent at it. Oh yeah, I forgot to... Uh, I Wait, forgot to actually turn off Nazim. I don't know what the hell is going on. Do you mind telling me? Yeah, I'll tell you in a sec. I forgot to turn off Nazim. So, congratulations, Nazim gets to spawn as well. You did it. Democracy won. Just accidentally, Democracy won. Month five, Duke Doug attempted to stop me from going to the bathroom again. I decided to take a crap in the trash can and like that five months soft built up crap was released. Can you wish my guy Lou Sassel a happy birthday? God, I took a crap the other day, made it look like the my toilet went through the large hadron collider. What is happening right now? Where's the dragon? Like I'm gonna be honest, my hypothesis about this helping my stealth is just not uh true yet. Is the dragon dead? Hey, okay, they're coming back. Okay. All the enemies are dead. They seem to have forgotten about me. Well, a few people died, but that's that's fine. Oh, Bran Shea fun died, fact, so that works. Mario's hat stands for oh, Monday. Excuse me, my lord. I'll be glad to sell you an elixir after I'm done with these fine people. <laughs> Professor Doug, do I have? Are they going to back to their speech? accounting homework. Come see me in the market if you're looking for the finest custom jewelry in all of Skyrim. So is it just back to normal now? When I'm done here. Please, please. Hold all your is this the game where we hunt down and kill the Mario? Can't okay. you bother me at my armor stand in the market? Or so desperate for training? all of the people stop doing things. It, they don't seem to like the bear. You could get taken to jail, Terry Slockpicks there. I think they're probably waiting on Bran Shea to say the next line. Uh, and I think there's one obvious solution here. Is someone there? Do something. We cause another distraction. And now, problems will just kind of sort itself out. Oh, oops, I got hit again. Oh, sorry. Oh, I think I'm in the line of fire over there. Sorry, excuse me. Oh, sorry. Sorry, let me get out of here. Just get out of the way. Why do people keep shooting me? Well, oh, I quick saved. <laughs> Fuck! Wait, did I save before this? The run is actually dead. I forgot to save. Oh my god. <laughs> that is so funny. Did I save? Oh, there's Branche. Ooh. Oh no. <laughs> Ooh. <clears throat> I'm 
thinking that we just leave town and I don't think it's going to be fine if I leave town and come back. Look at what's going on. Like this is, there's a dragon and a werewolf. If I come back, they're all going to be dead. It's not, it's not going to be like fine. There's two dragons in Riften. Um. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, don't hurt the chicken, though. Almost here. I'm so glad to give you this much of my life energy. I'm glad. I'll use it wisely for important uh, lessons. Wait for an hour, I guess. Two months of wildlife choices. Okay. Let me, uh, let me, let me restart. I mean, this is nice, but let me restart. Okay, so if I, oh, I can't wait Our during hero. combat. I think things would be smoother if at least two Nazis were there. <laughs> True. Thank you, it's your boy Boosh. Look, I added a few Nazines for you. Well, I don't want to be premature. I am less confident in my hypothesis that this mod will help. But let me get through the... I just have to remember to save at the beginning of scripted sequences. Because if I don't, then I'm boned. Thank you very much, it's your boy Boosh. Again, that is super generous. Um... But I literally have to... I literally have to, like, go back to the other <laughs> I have to go to an earlier save, because Branche is already dead. It's going to be broken. So I have to go back to this horse thing. Uh, we're restarting the run. Finally sort of. made it to a live stream. Sending love from the world of cat girls. Thanks, Nico. Okay, hold on. We're fine. Look, I'm going to... Uh oh, we're look, we're fine. I'm gonna come up here. Those are violets of blue. Doug forgot to save. Now his run is poo poo. No, my run is boo beautiful. So look, check this out. If I don't get to Riften in three lives, I'll gift five subs. There you go. Okay. Um, I need action music. Turtles. I get three shots off my horse. To make it to Riften safely. Oh, that's really fast. <laughs> okay, that was very fast. This might might be a warm up. Oh shit, I forgot to. That doesn't count. Yeah, you have to be in third person, otherwise you don't get shot. So I didn't do any shooting quite yet. Now I'm gonna do some shooting. What is happening to his Oh my god. This'll be fine. Shot number one. Oh my god. Oh, there were high Hrothgar! Alright, now I'm gonna land next to White Run. Check this shit out. Uh oh, I'm lost. Oh, I'm over in Wind Hell. Okay. Just, um, once again, my hypothesis is this mod will improve stealth-based gameplay, which I base off two things. When I'm discovered by enemies, the random units will provide a distraction for me to poof out and escape. However, this has not proven to be true if you're in a city. It's very bad if you're in a city, because then you kill everybody. <laughs> Hypothesis 2. When encountering difficult enemies, spawn units to fight them instead. Also sort of true, but it's not true in the city, because you kill everybody instead. But look. We're learning things. We're getting better. That was attempt... Was that one, or do I get another chance? Because I didn't... I did great. I flew beautifully. Even if Branche is dead, the mission will fail and the guy will recruit it's you. A oh bit shit. Late, but I wanted to clarify. Even if Branche is dead, if you wait, the mission will fail and the thief guy will recruit you anyway. You didn't have to restart. Uh oops. Good thing I can get back there very quickly. This is attempt one. Alright, here we go. Off to High Hrothgar.
I think I'm there. Oh, we're there. And I'm at high Hrothgar. Sweet. Okay. Now I need to launch myself. Do you not discover it from over here? Whatever, man. Whatever. I'm going to go over to the cliff. Now I make a save here. I go back to Horsey Boy. I'm going to build up speed. And then uh, I go to Rift. Trust me, I think more Nazims will help. Uh, that looks good. So how far away he gets from the horse uh, is how fast you'll move. So I want him like slightly out of frame for this one. Um, but this is still going to be really f fucking fast. Here we go. Oh my god. Okay, we're up here. I want to go... <laughs> Not this direction. I want to go over here. This is fine. This is honestly fine. Okay, that was death number one. I got two more. That should good. All right, going rifting. Oh my god! Oh no! It keeps going the wrong way. It's not my fault. It either shoots you left or right. All right, last one. I have to make it safely alive in Rift and Lake. Otherwise, five subs. Alright, give me a lot of speed. Like it. Right there, that's beautiful. Okay. This is the direction I'm aiming. I have to land in this lake. Wait, this lake? This lake. Oh my god! Oh, I did it! I went rifted! Go! <clears throat> and it's as simple as that. Where am I? I'm at Riften! Ah, fellow kitties. Cool. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitors tax. It just you need works. To pay the visitors tax. For the privilege of entering the I city. I think save. What yeah, sorry. Matter? I'll save once I'm in the city. I'll keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? I'll... Congrats, even though you cheated. I'm playing perfectly legit Skyrim the way it was meant to be played. All right. Okay, I don't want it to be this foggy. Is that really faster than fast traveling? Nobody knows for certain. It's probably faster. Definitely, I can definitely tell you for a short period of time I was moving faster. Do you know what seven means, Doug? It signifies the seven in 711, which is a massive global chain. That means you're sponsored by 711. Congrats on the massive sponsor, Doug. Fastest oh, okay. cat alive. Okay. Saving. Not making the same mistake as last time. Should I go, like, get a lockpick? I mean, I could do that. I had another run-in with a thief's guild. Oh, carrots. Fuck yeah. I mean, I could sell my carrots and, and apples and potatoes and buy a lockpick. I don't know you. You and Should Rick get some skooma. Once I learn how to speedrun, we can do... Back on time. Skyrim speedrun, but I'm... Also, on like a hundred skooma. If you wait for 24 hours, it'll auto fail. Oh, okay. Well, I want to try to do it, ideally. I want to like not intentionally skip the missions. Get arrested for lockpicks. The problem with being arrested 
is that it would have to be attacked. You don't need a lockpick. The ring is in an unlocked stand next to the crates. Okay, well, let me try the strategy of getting arrested. Welcome to Riften, home of the Thieves' Guild. Or so they'd have you believe. It's all lies. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her What did spawn? What say you in your defense? I guess you're smarter than you look. Hey, Doug, here is my sixth okay, I'm in month jail. of life force. Halfway to a year, Porg. They oh, give me a whole wheel of cheese? Pipe. Thanks, Tim. And they give me a lockpick. What kind of fucking jail is this? I mean, I know they do that in all the jails. I just, it hadn't, uh, quite resonated with me. Oh, no, that hit me! No, 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 no! I'm sleeping, I'm serving my time in jail. And we're good. <laughs> the guards are gonna come back and find that I'm not there, <laughs> but there's a, a horker so and a witch. So you're causing spawning you one or two things and too. trying to stealthily Running run away, none the, the wiser are running. you the cat in the hat? Yeah, if you think about it, this is a cat in the hat stream. I like where your head's at. All right, let's try to do this mission the way it was meant to be played. Your pockets, they're a little low on point. Thank you, piss mate, for the 12 months. It's all about sizing up your mark, lad. The way they walk. Hey, Daddy Douglas, it's been one year of my life donated to you. Oh, oh and I forgot to mention barn finder, barn finders, 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 barn Extra hands are well paid. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring. Cage match. Okay, steal the ring. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Brown Shay's pocket. True, and he could run. True. There's someone that won't. Nah. You tell me when you're ready? Good. Wait until All I right. start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Everyone. Okay, I do. I something amazing to show you that demands your attention. I only have one lockpick. When I got close, the mercy you need to hear this. Wow, I can't believe it's been 15 years since I subbed to you on Twitch. True. Thank you, Cloud Killer. Appreciate it very much. They just waved me off. I don't think he wants visitors anymore. Does anybody see me? Okay. It's just me and this lockpick. I wouldn't want you to get left out. That's what you said about the wisp And it turned out to be crushed nerve. Mixed with Several potatoes. What? Oh, come on. I get caught for putting potatoes in him? Shit. Oh, no. That was a cow. I don't know if the cow should be this. Dude, come on, man. I can't to put a few potatoes in the boy. Uh huh. Oh, thank you, cats. I'm happy for you. Okay, I'm gonna reload it. The one and only. Putting in three potatoes at once. So you're saying as long as I just slip in potatoes a little bit of a time? Okay. I mean, I I should be able to slide a carrot in there a little easier, Cocaine right? toss. Let me try. Okay. Shh, shh, shh. <laughs> Mystical 
Okay, so he's very sensitive to potatoes. My longest relationship ever. Can I take it back? Not put it back in. Oh no. Okay. Those fools are actually fighting. Where am I? I'm, I'm not trying to be gross here, but like, what is actually? <laughs> okay. I don't understand the difference between why I can put carrots in him but not potatoes. At any rate, put in the ring. And we're good. Make it quick. Damn. I knew I should wait. Looks like I chose the right person good. for the job. Okay, care. Here you go. Um, Your payment. Just as I promised. The way things have been going around here, it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. I would I mean, it's a very, very Please easy be starter mission. My children. Nah. My organization's been having a uh, I'll be luck. the brother of your I suppose children. that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You Potatoes did job, are only a 53% well. success rate. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. I can handle it. All right, then. Let's put that to the test. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Rifton. Okay. A tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Okay. Get there in one piece, and we'll see if you've really got what it takes. Okay. First mission is done. What is it with you and all these questions? Very well. Does that? Okay. Again, the hypothesis is spawning random enemies help with stealth-based gameplay. That very much did not help. But that's not really a mission, right? I feel like we it's stealth missions where I'm going around enemies, right? Does that count as one of my three missions? This is my first stream in over a year. Anything I need to know? Nah. Nap, nah, Skyrim. That's just a tutorial. Yeah, I made it kind of hard, but... It's not really a tutorial, but it's not like a stealth mission. So, okay. Again. Plan is still beat three stealth missions with the, the new and improved stealth tactics. And then I want to beat one stealth mission with me not attacking you anybody. <laughs> Thank you, Emma. Emily. It's a sneaky mission, not a stealth mission. Yeah, but again, today's lesson is on sneakery, so it is relevant, but it's, yeah, it's not really coming into play at all. All right, cool. Uh, let's get to the actual missions then. Away. Going to the Ragged Flagon. Well, I could look for more potatoes. Nah, I only I only like carrots and potatoes. Beautiful bubbles and gleaming gentle. Does fall damage count? No. I don't believe so. I should probably take this weapon, right? I don't have any weapons. I don't have any armor or weapons, but that's fine. Uh, it's a stealth gameplay. Really, I need to wheel. find I need to find a bow and arrow as fast as possible. Unknown hero, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it very much. Fall damage didn't count, but the bucket earlier did. So the way the way the reason I can't give you a definitive answer is because Skyrim modding is weird and a lot of times does not behave like you think it should. Uh, that being said, there's an event that can fire. Uh, called on hit and it's when the player is hit so that's when I'm that's when I'm running the code um, that being said I don't know exactly when this event fires <clears throat> one year so many fond memories thank you for existing and I hope you do well always PSA dragon yeah that donation was starting to drag on you don't want to get hit so why should you why would you wear armor good point gray wolf I don't need it where I'm going. I don't know. Let's get us alive. What was that? Okay, so here's my first hypothesis. I don't have to fight these guys. I can let them hit me, 
create a distraction like a smoke grenade, and then I run through them to safety. Oh, oh never mind. For too long. Okay, the bear's blocking. I need. Okay, I need my smoke grenade to get out of the. There we go. And he's in the roof. <laughs> We're fine. Santa's <laughs> working perfectly. <clears throat> now we just we keep going. I'm telling you. Oh my god! Okay, uh, I got hit by a trap that spawned a dragon. But it, sh it should be fine. Because the dragon can't fly. Is that a skeever? Uh oh. Okay, this is a cow. Cow, can you move? Oh, the, dr the dragon's attacking the cow, I think. Uh oh, oh, here's the team. Okay, so again, uh, I've created a little bit of a smoke bomb here, and now I get to make my escape. Excuse me. Excuse me. All right. And no one's the wiser. You see back there, the smoke grenade is taking care of things. We do have a bit of a dragon problem, but that's fine. your bits for a while and recently started watching your streams. Been subbed for two months now and just wanted to say keep up the good work. Hey, thank you. Thank you, Grey Wolf. Oh, man. Easy. I don't know, man. I would argue... That hypothesis number one was just proven. I think the dragon is inside you. I, I've got a lot of carrots, potatoes, and dragons in me, but... He, like, that worked. Wasn't a stealth mission, but... As part of missions... You know? You know what I mean. Come on, there's something s smart to be derived here. We've got this. <clears throat> I'm telling you, this one is different. We've all heard that one before, Bryn. Quit kidding yourself. It's time to face the truth, old friend. All right. You well, well. Yeah. Let's learn lore. I wasn't certain I'd ever it can be considered stealth before. when the enemy saw you. Eh, I think... I don't know, that was stealthy. Getting here was easy. I almost got killed. No risk, no reward. That's the way it goes, so you better get used to it. What kind of a name now, is Brynjolf? If you're done belly aching it's a good like a American child, name. How about handling a few deadbeats for me? Oh shit, these are the um the brawls with people, right? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. <laughs> you don't have to brawl though. I mean the brawls could be badass if you think about it. I mean, we could absolutely destroy them and their children and families and anyone they've ever known or loved. Destroy all of Riften. Right? That's how you send a message. Thieves' Guild needs to get stricter. Kirava, Bercy Honeyhand, and Hilda. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Kill them. We'll kill their family. We'll kill literally anyone within a mile radius because there's going to be too many dragons and bears and shit. They want me to handle Honestly, it. the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across. Get the message across. The I'm reading you loud and clear, Brynjolf. Oh, don't. No. Oh. Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. <sighs> cool. Uh, let's go kill people. I'll be here when you're done. Oh my god. Rift. Oh, I can't... How do I get back out? It's up here, right? Message is more important. He did say message is more important. How do I... Where, I always forget this, dude. Where is the easy exit? You have to go the same way? But isn't there the easy, like, button that you press to come out of the graveyard 
Sorry I'm late, Professor. Things seem to be going swimmingly. Oh, the dragon is still in here. Ooh. Take that. I don't... I feel like I do not need armor, right? I'll take a broom, though. Oh, my God. Okay. A few crabs and a chicken. Nothing to worry about, though. Uh, we have to intimidate, but not kill people. I don't remember how to do it. All you don't have to fight any of them, right? Beautiful baubles and gleaming gemstones over here. All right. Oh, this lady. Yo, Mr. Red. I always have to hit his vase, right? Gag, 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 gag. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, so, can I interest you in I have a message today? from Bernulf. What? Oh, it's one of you. So, Bernulf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? Petty threats and fist waving are not going to sway me. You people are all talk, and everyone knows it. You demand payment for protection. You can't even protect yourselves. We can protect ourselves, yourself. trust me. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of Rifkin. I've had enough of this. Likewise. Now I have a lot to do. I'm afraid you'll just have to leave. How did it become 14 months already? Sorry, I guess I've been behind the bleachers for far too long. To Sorry, Coach. Thanks, Artabel. That took so... Wait, what? Oh, shit. Hey, do you want to brawl now? <laughs> He's attacking very quickly, which is kind of an issue. Uh... So, let's say he... Let's say he dies. I technically beat the mission. Right? Um, all right, we're good. Oh, oh, there's a spider. Oh, there's a lot of things down here. Okay, he's dead. But I can take his money. What did I miss? And his lock pick, and I'm good now, right? Just leave that down there. Enough. Oh, there's a bear. <laughs> okay. I guess they overflowed out of the house a little bit. Okay. I think... <clears throat> I think I need to update uh, the hypothesis a bit. Uh, one sec.
Okay. Based on the results so far, I think we can safely say spawning enemies is very bad if you're talking to normal people. But, new hypothesis, I just have to save before every single fight. Because that way, even if I happen to get nicked by a pot or whatever else hit me, we can still bail out of there and it's fine. I still contend that this mod is good for stealthing through hostile places. It's really bad for stealthing through citizens. Question, wouldn't your chances of success statistically be improved if every hit spawned a random enemy and a cheese meal? Oh, oh my god. Um, stati yeah, you are statistically correct. All right, let me get through a mission, and then a mission or two, and then I'll try passive, and then we'll try ha adding a lot more things that happen when I get hit. We'll do it in that order, so it'll climax. Uh, I have a message from Bernie Ulf. Uh, what? So Bernie now Ulf do you see why I kept telling you to save Doug? You demand pain yeah, but I like to live on the edge. And you can't even protect yourself. Don't I had to learn yourself. it through experience. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of risk. What? Okay. I know I literally just made this new hypothesis, but what if I brawl? That could be badass. I'm going to make you sorry for this. Oh, let's go, motherfucker. Get him, I. Oh, the mission's completed. One sec. <clears throat> As I was saying, spawning enemies is bad if you're talking to normal people. Just brawl them. Uh, victim number two. Got a message for you. This isn't going to work out like you think. Oh, yeah? It was never a request. Don't say I didn't warn you! Let's go! Just you, me, and that skeleton, and that werewolf, and that troll, and that skeleton, and that skeleton. <laughs> Wait, is the mission completed? All right, now I just. I guess it can be wrong since it's just a guess, but I guess changing the hypothesis works. I felt. Oh, there's a chicken. I felt like that actually was fine initially. Brynjolf makes you pay the debt if you die. If they die. Well, I hope he accepts carrots and potatoes, because I have no money. Okay. My skill in battle is unmatched. Fortunately for you, that skill can be here for a room or something. One more time. I've already told that the fool that I'm not. Look around you. Don't say I didn't warn you. It's just me? You? My fists? That Draugr. That troll. You need to stop hitting me, lady. <laughs> You're making this a lot worse for yourself. Okay, and this once she dies, I win the mission. Okay. I think I won. Okay, the mission marker is there. And we did it. I think the giant is stuck. Oh my god. Um. Okay, that did not complete the quest. What? Who's this guy? I have a question. Do you have to land the final blow? Why? Why did that-
Why did that work on the previous guy? Because my hypothesis is pretty strong. Spoon. What what changed? You have to kill the NPC yourself. I didn't kill the last NPC. He just died. Like, he just fucking got knocked over. What do you mean? How did I kill him? I, I punched him. That doesn't even kill... You're not even supposed to kill them with a punch during a brawl. Because you killed him. All right. Maybe you need a first hit. But I hit her last time. Yeah, essential NPCs are off. Um, but but still, I beat the quest last time. These aren't essential NPCs anyway, because you you can kill them. All right, how do I how do I do this without fighting her? I already told that buffoon that I'm not paying you people a single coin. Look around you. I'm barely keeping. You won the brawl before he died. Oh. to that. Oh, because NPCs become essential during a brawl. That makes sense. Good, and take this little message back to your bosses. Why don't you just try to pick pocket them when they turn their back? Ever. I like the way you think. wait for her to not see me. I'm not sure if that's possible here, because I'm <laughs> very conspicuous. Cats are too strong and kill with less moves during brawls. No. When she's not paying attention. Three potatoes. <laughs> Why, do, Why do I even get charged with crimes if I'm giving people potatoes? I'm like a cat Robin Hood. Talk to a lizard dude and he'll tell you about her fam. Okay, do I talk to him first or second? Let me save here to be safe. Uh, first? Professor, I ask that we have a detention session to read our notes so I may bring a very important pause to light. We need to come together, come together, cat pick gang. Uh, sure. Look, I don't know what goes on in detention, all right? Probably all sorts of. Hey, Doug, literally watching this on our honeymoon best day ever. Thanks a bunch. Hey, congratulations, Mart. Where's her dad Steal or whoever? Steal the cheese. You said I'm supposed to talk to her, like, brother or something? What do I do? They never consented to getting potatoes. Imagine somebody sneaks up to you and put potatoes in your pocket. I would love to make a video about that. Like you go in public and you and you give you put potatoes in people's like, purse or, or like their their luggage at the airport. I won't do this, obviously. I feel like it's not ethical, but it, like it's not that unethical. You know, a lot of people would be fine with it. I think. Now is not the time for exploration and discovery. I'm relieved to hear you say that. If you were to leave, I'd miss you. Is he downstairs? Aaron, I owe you my people are remember people are more tolerant with carrots. To all of Skyrim for me to depart. <laughs> I don't have oh, any here. business with you, so get out what of here. Epic Draz, thank you so much for the 12 months. I appreciate it. You might want to talk some sense One in the key you're up. Alive. With wow. the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want. No, what is I what I do is I I do that right. So I like go to the beach or whatever, and like when people aren't looking, I go and like put like three potatoes in their bag. Any recommendation <clears> for <throat> getting through formal languages? Also, here's to another four months. And then I walk up to them and I'm like, Hey, I know this is a weird request. Like I, I act as though I'm gonna like ask them for the time. I'm like, Hey, I know this is a weird request. Any chance you guys have potatoes? I am super hungry and I love potatoes. And they're like, No, but they'll be. But you have some in your bag. I can see them. I can see that potato bulge. Because <laughs> that's the one-two punch. And then the best the part is maybe they'll like... is already filled with potatoes. Yeah, that's true. That that So that's like the third level, right? But the second level is that then they get to feel good because they get to give like a random person a potato and make their day. It could be a positive 
experience for everybody involved. I make content, they get the feeling that they gave somebody potatoes. Um, yeah, but then the weird part would be, what if they have potatoes already? Um, no, actually, it's the same outcome. It's still a positive thing. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to... With the rumors going around, I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't Local streamer arrested for sexual... How is that sexual harassment? It's like... family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. You mentioned Bud you know, harassment? Hey, Doug, can you ask me a question? Just please don't harm anyone. I could yeah. Bear the thought. Could I? Oh, also, I missed a question. Any recommendations for getting through formal languages? I don't know what... Do you mean human languages, Sergeant Navigator? Or is that like a programming question? Either way, since I don't know, I can't give you advice, but I hope it goes well. For a room or something to drink? Show me some coin first. Are you ready to pay? Bring you off what you owe. No, and I never will. Now get out of my. If head. life gives you potatoes, make potato weed. I would. Can you do that? Can you make juice out of potatoes? Maybe should. How could you possibly know about ways my family needs Eight too much punk, to me? What do we name the baby? Them. Uh, we'll name him Eight Months. But every month we'll change his name. Uh, Drunker, if you just go to vodka. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Wait, really? Vodka's made out of potatoes? I assume it's not. You don't just like juice. You don't just put potatoes in like a blender, right? And that doesn't make vodka. I assume there's something more to Olivia it. Olivia Doug. Some vodka is made from potatoes. Oh. Vodka is potato juice. Not always, but yes. Potato ferment... It's fermentation. Because that'd be cool also on the beach if I... Then I juice the potatoes and I, like, give people vodka. So it just keeps going back and forth. Very this is a really good content Here. idea. Take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. All right, cool. Uh, we did it without killing people. <laughs> I don't feel good about it, but technically we did it without killing people. Is it possible to milk a potato? I don't think they have nipples. Apparently you can make potato juice. Two months left, go. How goes the apology video? It's going on still i still need to do it i've just past it's month you. just has been bad Please, hopefully soon me. i know i have to do it um okay i have a message I know who you are. you've been terrorizing the entire city please there's no need for that here message understood here i even have the payment i did it what else did you want now can I? I forget. Oh I'd appreciate it if you'd keep your hands to yourself. Dude, I came out of a door. This is not my fault. <laughs> She's the type of lady who would put potatoes in my luggage for sure. Can't I? I thought I could. You can't. Whatever. I have to go back to the rat way. That's a real potato, Karen. So Doug, why you should do a stream do I have finding clothes? out what the biggest item is that you can sneak into someone's pocket without them noticing. Like, can you sneak in a cabbage, a sword, maybe a halberd? The possibilities may be endless. I did. My, 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 uh, my college friends. If you can't milk potatoes, then explain almond milk checkmate. <laughs> True. Almonds are just small potatoes when you think about it. Uh, my college friend, I stayed at his he was out of the country for a few months so i stayed at his apartment for a little while because it was close to my work <clears throat> and i was drinking a shitload of milk at that time i had like a third of a gallon of milk a day <clears throat> and so i'd just be buying all these gallons of milk and <laughs> every time every time i finished a gallon of milk i would hide it in his room somewhere and he did not like it 
So every time he would like come back and visit, like every month or so, there'd be like 12 or 13 gallon jugs of milk hidden in different places of his room. And so they would be like in his, <laughs> in his like in his luggages, under the bed, like taped to the ceiling behind the lampposts, like just everywhere. But it got to the point because he would find so many that he would give up. And so <laughs> like a year, I only did this for like two months. And then like a year later, he sent me a picture of, um, he's <laughs> like, I'm moving out and found this milk jug in the back corner of my closet. And it was behind like some like boxes and stuff way in the corner. And <laughs> it was like pitch black at that point. I didn't realize how gross it would get. It was all contained in, in the container, but it was just, it was like a hell had developed inside the, the milk card. It was very gross. Uh, in retrospect, it was kind of mean. But he and I, he and I like prank each other like that. So it was in good fun. But man, I totally forgot about that. Um, hiding potatoes would be a great variation. I think potatoes would actually be more disruptive because potatoes start like growing sprouts and shit. So they would actually like potentially grow into your walls. At least with milk, you know, it's just gross. But it doesn't, it doesn't escape the milk carton. Google how bad this potatoes is smell. Important. Are walnuts really just nut eggs if you think about it? What? If you can milk a potato, where are its nipples? You just have to squeeze really hard. Alright. Aren't all nuts eggs then? Sometimes. Nuts are tree eggs. Maybe that's what we'll discuss in the next trial. Okay, back to the Thieves Guild. Oh wait, there's a whole bunch of shit in here, right? Would you consider some freshly squeezing some lobster juice atop of a honey glazed potato baked for two hours at 350? With a hint of hickory. Yeah, that sounds great. Um... All right, back to the Thieves' Guild. I don't remember if there's a lot of stuff. Okay, there's Mr. Krabs who's eating a dog. So as long as I just kind of get past him, should be okay. Sweet. I thought it would only be like one person. I don't know if this hypothesis is necessarily st st still true. <clears throat> We're fine. I just, I, in general, I don't want to brawl people unless I have to. Come back later, and I may have some work for you. Are you daft? What's going on I told you not to break? kill any of them. How much clearer do you need me to be? Look at the hypothesis, Brynjolf. Look at it. Or was that too difficult an instruction as well? Hey, hey, sorry. I just get jealous when I hear rumors I suppose it's not a total loss then. That's all they are. Let me give you a piece of advice. If you want to make some serious coin in this business, you need to... Please make it so rules. it spawns stuff when no, anything is hit. I'll try that nearer the end of the stream. To be very clear, like, that will crash the game quickly. I had, I had an idea for a mod, which was every 10 seconds, every enemy makes a copy of itself. And I was like, oh, that's pretty funny. I, mean, I can show you guys at, later in the stream. I was like, oh, that's a funny concept. Like, people just, like, grow, you know, they, like, clone themselves really fast. The issue is that everything exponentially increases, so it's a horrible idea. And it crashes very fast. Like, it, <laughs> it's, it, like, it covids the whole world in like 15 seconds and then the game crashes so you have to somewhat limit it or it all gets out of hand fight your mistakes i see more potential in you than half the snot nosed footpaths that stumble their way into the flag i'm going to put my neck on the line we need people like you in our outfit that's the spirit 
larcenies in your blood. Super Poggers, if you don't beat this you must drink a quart of scum milk, not cat milk, not regular milk, not human milk, pure 100 skunk milk. Is that a thing? And I have a follow-up question, because I've always wondered this. Why don't we eat dog cheese? Hello, Doug, am I a good spectator? Thanks, Ollie. Yeah, right? Why Why have we never eaten dog cheese? You could totally do it. Think about it. Yeah. What the fuck? Ooh, why, why are we allowed to go make cheese out of goat's milk? Dogs make milk? I'm not, like, I'm not saying I necessarily want to do it. I'm just asking, why, why don't we eat dog cheese? Male dog milk. No, no, no. Human cheese. Can we make human cheese? When Is that I was a thing? 18, I found a tiny old backpack that I used to use when I was in kindergarten. So I opened the pockets and found a sealed Ziploc bag with a wad of used tissue in it that had not only started to decompose into dirt, but it was also covered in gross mold. I'm pretty sure it had been in there. <clears throat> yeah, that that sounds disgusting. I'm gonna make sure this is uh, safe for work. Human cheese. Wait, this is a thing. Okay, well it's age restricted. Human cheese, a new social enterprise. Whose boobs are you drinking from? They come from excited employees that live fulfilling lives. That's weird. Have any of you guys had human cheese? Borat's wife made... Oh, God. I did not watch the second Borat movie. <clears throat> I'm not saying I want to. But we have to finally air out these questions. It's the elephant in the room. Um, all right, hold on. Let me Google dog cheese real fast. Do people eat dog cheese? Cheese safe for dogs. No, no, no. It's telling me that dogs can eat cheese. That's not the question I'm asking. Do people eat cheese made out of dogs? Well, that actually sounds bad. Out of dog nipples. Can you make cheese this out of dog milk? Quora. Here. Is this normal? We always talk about dog cheese, bro. <clears throat> One sec. Any second, Quora will let us know about this. Google, like, Google saw my question, we know and it was like... We know you hate stop trying to get us to eat dog cheese. I do hate Gouda now. Google saw my question and was like, Doug, can I please get you back to a normal topic? And I was like, no! The cheese is made out of dog milk. Wu two to the power of four moths, and months are good too. Even Quora is has shut down their website to try to try to stop us from the secret First of dog of all, cheese. Dogs are not livestock. <coughs> Second, every mammal creates a different kind of milk, so it probably tastes bad. I know for a fact that pig cheese is like eating grease. Oh, interesting. <clears throat> I'm not saying I want to eat dog milk. I'm. In 2017, a farm in Mid Wales has <clears throat> launched the world's first range of dog cheeses. The cheese is made from dog's milk and has gone on sale stores nationwide. Is that real? Perhaps that stumbled their way. <clears throat> so there is the dog flag. cheese. Okay. I'm going to I want to be. On the line. We need people like you in our outfit. I want to be extremely clear here. I do not want to eat dog cheese. But that would be a really, really, really insane punishment to have to eat some for like a Skyrim One Health stream. If somebody, if somebody has a link, just email it to me. <clears throat> Where does all the cheese in Skyrim come from? There are not a lot of cows in the game, <laughs> and it's not all goat cheese. And there's a lot of dogs. Oh man! So you're saying that stream where I ate a ten wheel pound of cheese? While spawning cheese wheels into Skyrim, that was like 3,200 dog cheese wheels. Dogs are extremely fertile in Skyrim. It's a different breed. That's the spirit. I think you'll do more than just fit in. Before we go, I have to Watch ask. On your mind. 
We've run into a rough patch. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Is that enough? Now, if there are no more questions, all right, I'll let's do a uh, show you what we're all about. Little room tour. Is that legal? You better not make I mean, I would not want to support it if it's unethical. Definitely. But if that donation was real, and there's a company which is... <laughs> Sorry, let me just get <clears throat> this sentence <clears throat> prepared. If there, if there is... <clears throat> if there is a company that is ethically making dog cheese, then I will purchase some as part of a punishment wheel. Doug video idea? But it has to be ethical. Some dog milk and churn your own cheese with an old school churner. Even better, make dog butter and put it on some toast. <laughs> dog butter. <laughs> oh man, because you could make dog cream, right? Sometimes you unmute a stream and everything in your life starts to make sense. Look, <clears throat> we're here to learn. Okay, sometimes we got to talk about the tough subjects. Sometimes old Doug's gotta sit down Are with you. Saying, Doug, cheese or Doug cheese? Tell you about the birds and the bee cheese. You can make doggert. <laughs> okay, okay, if if there's a company that makes ethically farmed dog cheese, then I wanna make dog yogurt and label it as dogurt. Doggert? <laughs> Is it doggert? How do you pronounce it? <laughs> There's cat cheese? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> if you're allergic to cats, are you allergic to cat cheese? Oh. God, I wish... You know how Belle Delphine made... Did, like, gamer bath water and sold it? I would love if I could lactate. Because I can make <laughs> Duggart and sell it as, like, a premium... Like, like, the top Patreon tier. Yeah, the cat cheese has to be ethical. Do skunk milk? Is skunk milk... Could you turn skunk milk into goat, into yogurt? Because it'd be skunkgurt. That's not as good as doggurt. <laughs> You're a horrible person? Dude, I'm, I'm not gonna have any of it unless it's ethically raised dog cheese. I'm serious. I'm not, like, if it's some janky fucking, you know, like, Russian mob is, like... That, that would be bad, right? There's no way I would support something like that. It would have to be ethical. Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Which kind of dog? Dude, I'm not the dog cheese expert here. I don't know. Men can lactate, I promise. I yeah, but I'm not going to make like a vat of Duggar with my own lactation. I thought men can... Check Twitch DM. I thought men can lactate like a minuscule amount. Get your dog cheese from Wales. This is real? No way. No, this is not real. I was lying in bed last year and wondering how I was going to afford to keep a herd of cows. They're big, expensive. And I was lying there wearing my dog came up and sniffed my ass. At first I told her to go away, but then it hit me like a thunderbolt. Why not farm dark dog why not farm dog milk? There's no way this is real. Yeah, no no no. This is this is clearly making fun of people like me who've wondered about dog cheese. Royston butterscotch, yeah, no. Skunk yogurt is skunk skirt. Doesn't quite roll off the tongue like dogger. According to Scientific America, men Do I can make lactate. Clear? <laughs> I did not hear anything you said, but. Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. It's simple, get a dog. I am not going to milk my not own dog and make dog Hawaii. cheese. That sounds Even fucked up. Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work, so let him prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest... <laughs> 
However, the owner has I, decided I don't to want to ask Monterey Bay Aquarium about that. Us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brignol will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Would it taste salty? I have nipples dug. Can you milk me? Um, Welcome to the thieves guild. Given that your name is Brad, I'm gonna guess no. Welcome to the family lab. <clears throat> I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin. So don't disappoint me. Human milk? Okay, we've already established that human milk and cheese is sold as a luxury product already. The question is about dog cheese. Okay, we're here to talk about dog cheese. Bird ice cream? What does that mean? How do I get my cut of spoils? Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Bex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to keep My some wife extra came in and found me way. milking the dog oh, for dog cheese. I talked to That's when the divorce flagging. happened. She'll set you up with your new armor. <laughs> okay, tell me about the Golden Glow. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some honey? smart mouth wood elf named Arangoth. Or we bee milk. Safe in the main house. What's the catch? the catch? Is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. I that might have an issue with that. Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. That's not how things work around here. The guild depends on. So an don't you want mama dog milk cheese keep things or daddy smoothly. dog milk cheese? Without them at our backs. Why would dad trouble. dogs? Be able to make dog cheese. That doesn't make sense. Maven I came into the room to find my husband alive. milking the dog for cheese. To stop I don't know why he <laughs> filed for divorce. After. He filed the divorce. The guild has a lot riding on. <laughs> I assume the situation was that he got caught dog. trying to make dog cheese. <laughs> Not that he got Can caught trying to make dog cheese and promptly filed milk. for divorce. Uh can dogs eat milk chocolate from dog milk? That's a good question, because, yeah, they're allergic to chocolate. Um, okay, I think we're good. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. Okay, we've got the next quest, which is to go to Golden Glow Estate and steal the thing from the owner guy and burn some bees. This will be the first mission where I really have to focus on stealth in a meaningful no, way. I am afraid to inform you that honey is bee vomit. All is it? Are on you, lad. Don't is that true? Yes. Sort of. I, I genuinely, I don't know, I do not know how they turn the pollen into honey. So I assumed it went out their nipples like milk, protege. but... Don't look like much to me. Breed your fight. Um, where do I get armor? So you're the new recruit, huh? Well, looks like you and I are gonna have to get very well acquainted. Oh, sorry, drop my pen. Do bees have nipples? I don't think bees have nipples. Only mammals have nipples, right? I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for I'm it. I'm starting a, a lizard milk company. Guild, of course. Any advice? I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small um, fee. I'm not sure. I don't... I don't believe lizards have nipples. When she caught me making dog cheese, I had to divorce her because if I didn't, she would eat it all. <laughs> That's true. You're like, um... Walter White hiding your precious meth money in the house. Sure. How about I get dirged to knock She's been wondering how these the big payments keep coming in, Look, even though you're only I've a high school teacher. A long time, Turns I've out you've been making dog types. cheese under the table. You can play it tough or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all good. Then here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. Yeah, I got you. All right then. Doug, hear me out, boob cheese, or maybe Ewok cheese? Um, I don't. Are Ewoks mammals? They're probably lizards. So, you're Brynjolf's new Uh, okay. What about whale cheese? Whales are mammals. Today, 
don't look like much to me. Is that, is that real? Can you milk a whale? Hold on. I'm gonna search white-tailed deer milk or alligator milk. This is another, uh, potentially not suitable for... Can you milk a whale? Another Duck Duck sub sub thanks for the laughs, Mr. Teacher Duck Duck sir. Hey, thanks, you taco. Doug, I am confused. My dog is a male, but every time he humps my leg, he gives milk. Nope. 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 Okay, a few whale species may drink more than 150 gallons of milk a day. I'm sure they wouldn't miss one gallon of whale milk that I take to my factory and turn into whale cheese. Like, come on, 150 gallons? I could make so much cheese with a gallon of whale milk. So I was just doing dog things and my owner came in and started milking me going on about making cheese or something. His wife left and he took me in the divorce. In scared Doug. <clears throat> my time to shine. Thanks, Juniper. Appreciate it. Yeah, it's a funky ass song. Oh shit, I forgot about the crabs. Uh, as long as they don't spawn anything bad, we're fine. Okay. Let's go to Golden Glow. What's okay. about platypus milk? Uh, did I just absorb a dragon? <laughs> okay, I don't know where that came from. That's fine. <laughs> I'm not even clear. Was that in the rat? Was that in the rat way? Okay. Let's get back to daytime. That was dragon milk. <laughs> Cloop cheese. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Can you guys stop being gross? Let's go. Let's go uh, steal shit. It's finally time to test the hypotheses. Watch out for sewer dragons. <clears throat> I'm more worried about sewer crabs. One of the reasons why dog cheese isn't a thing is because it is incredibly hard to milk dogs. Not only do they pretty much only produce milk when they have puppies, oh. but the way soft nipples are designed makes it very difficult to milk them. Dogs' nipples are hard to milk because it's an important part of the- T.I.L. Very cool. You need to acknowledge the milk fiasco in the stream highlights. Um... I don't know that I do. I think this is just between us, you know? I've heard- a lot of people have told me that, like, my streams feel like the YouTube videos, because, like, the music and everything. Um, but, but there needs to be some reward, you know, when you come here and you watch live. And that reward is talking about dog cheese for 45 minutes. All right, we're going to Golden Glow Estate. We're going to steal their stuff and burn their bees. And be stealthy. Address the milk or you're a coward. How would I even incorporate this into the YouTube video? That doesn't make sense. I would have to like... <laughs> I could have... I can make the mod so that every time I get hit, it spawns a dog and then that dog starts spawning cheese. Doug, will you make this But I feel like it's off, we're off topic. Video? If you do, I think you should include the cheese mayhem poop style. Nah, we... I just, I don't want my YouTube audience to know how gross you guys are. This is how dog cheese was meant to be played. Let's 
What's up? Wildly strange time to resub talking about nips and milk and cheeses, but I'm sure it'll only get stranger somehow, and I doubt any of us would have it any other way. So you're embarrassed? No, Does I'm embarrassed Pepsi for you. You guys nipples? are talking about whale cheese. Does Pepsi Man have nipples? Uh, I don't know. I mean, Pepsi Man milk would just would just be um, cherry Pepsi. Pink Panther milk? To be strawberry milk. Wait, so are you telling me come and visit bear cheese? You telling me what? Cam and <laughs> I thought I was eating bear cheese! <clears throat> How about Doug milk? I do not produce milk. Unfortunately. Dude, I would absolutely make yogurt out of my milk if I could lactate. Is that deer just staring at me? Oh, okay. I thought it was like stalking me. That was really creepy looking. Um, all right. So first I'm going to go for the beehives, then we're going to go into the estate to try to actually take out the guy. The beehives, there's going to be a lot He's of mercenaries around, so him. I would, I think this is where hypothesis number two comes into play. I think Golden Glow Estate is where encountering difficult enemies and intentionally spawning units could really work, because... We're fine wiping Hello, out all of the mercenaries guarding this place, and then I go in and just take the rest, right? Let's try it. Like, genuinely, I think this could work. Thank you, Milkman. A platypus lays eggs and produces milk. It can make custard. Ooh. Germa's already done? Two and a half hours. Okay, so they found me. So what I'm going to do is offer myself up. Uh, they made a cow, they made a werewolf. And I'm just going to let them make a few friends. Real cheese is real. You can buy it on Wix. It's made from all also, apparently, Wayland has the Uh, okay, those, that seems like enough friends. And now, I've created a smoke bomb. I book it over to the bees. So, if dogs make dog cheese, why does cabbage make him cheese? <laughs> True. Beehives are done. The Pinkie Pie smoke bomb is still going off. Now I go over to the house. I am too busy eating chicken to stay. By the time you see this message, I will be gone. Okay, this smoke bomb has worked very well. Now, sneak into the house with no one the wiser. Is the mammoth the mercenary? Aren't, people are trying to clone mammoths, right? And bring them back? If we clone mammoths, first thing we should do is make mammoth cheese. Like what? I mean, cows make great milk, right? Mammoths are basically big cows. Could actually be like a great... The crazy thing with bananas, there used to be a more flavorful, like, type of bananas. The and they literally went extinct because of a fungus. Me over cheese until they found out what animals produced the milk. 
Yeah, it, it can cause issues. You can get me badger cheese? Bro. Why are we talking milk so much? Uh, I don't know. Somebody in chat brought it up, I think. Um, oh, there's actually mammoth cheese in this game, huh? But so here, here's here's my what I'm saying. Bananas used to be there used to be a better like species, I guess, of bananas, and those went extinct because of a fungus that targeted them. Uh, and so we have the current strain of bananas, and those are that fungus is actually hey, spreading as well, and it's a no, big issue in the banana industry. This is real. And we're not sure if the wheels of cheese are actually made from dog's milk, but we know there is one mammal that we're sure of that Skyrim is plenty of, and that is skeevers. So. Could that we'll, mean that the wheels of cheese are actually skeever cheese? We have no idea what the cheese in Skyrim is made out of. The point of this is to say, mammoths used to walk the earth. And what if they're like old bananas and they have way better tasting milk? What if it naturally tastes like chocolate milk, but they went extinct and we had to deal with like boring old normal cows all this time? Dude, if we clone mammoths and they turn out to be like, like super cows, it could be sick. And we're probably, we probably wouldn't be, oops, we probably wouldn't be lactose intolerant to them either because our ancient ancestors probably suckled on that mammoth tit all day. Can Whereas, ca like, cows are pretty recent in our, in human history, right? We've got to clone a mammoth, dude. After 14 months, have you had nun's milk? That's really old. Non's milk? Ooh, let's go. First try. Like, this could be made out of anything. How many dogs... How many dogs did you sacrifice, Nazim, to make this wheel? Literally says what? No, it just says it just said cheese. What are you talking about? Goat? Yeah, but that could be an acronym for like a dog. <clears throat> I literally, I so desperately want dog cheese to exist. Apparently, that I just, I didn't see the word goat. Like I, I'm not exaggerating. Like my brain just filtered it from what I'm looking at. I swear it just Jesus said cheese. Wheel. Holy shit, Tony. Tony just gifted 48 subs. Uh, thank you. Can we get a few Doug Doug cheese champs in the chat? My god. And you subbed. <laughs> Thanks, Tony. Dude, that's insane as always. Tony, uh, you're nuts. I appreciate it. Also, how are you so good at programming? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> You're insane. You just learn everything so fast. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Tony. Um, and for all the wonderful modding you do. I appreciate it. Oh, wait, sorry. This is a stealth mission. I gotta I gotta keep that in mind. Thank you very much, Tony. List of milks I know you can buy from the store. One, two, of flax, good soy almond, cashew, macadamia, banana, chocolate, strawberry, coconut, fat-free. Fat-free isn't, like, a category of milk. They don't, like, Hello, make Dick, milk out of fat. A job offer as a software developer. Oh, shit! And this is gonna sound cheesy and far-fetched, but had you not been such a huge inspiration to me, cough, coffee, a microtransactions, this may not have happened. Thank you, I will now contribute to your life course with my future salary. That is fucking awesome. Congratulations, my dude. Well-deserved. I'm really happy for you. Uh, that's awesome. Congrats. What's also, way to incorporate cheese, cheese into the donation method. Uh, man, fucking cool. Very cool. Did Doug just say fat-free milk doesn't exist? No, I obviously fat-free milk exists. Please invest it in Doug cheese wheels. Look, I'll get our top scientist figuring out how to extract milk from me so we can make Duggart. I just don't. I just don't know how. Goat I just cheese, don't know how likely that is to happen. Of cheese. What was I gonna say? I already forgot. Something. 
Oh, fat free. Yeah. Look, I know fat free exists, right? But that is a category of an animal cheese, right? Fat fat free milk is not like its own thing separate from cow milk, right? Fat free is a type. So you can't just say one of the types. You can't be like, oh, the types are like cow milk, goat milk, almond milk, milk fat free just milk. Like my mom. There, there you go. What if the dog's name was milk? True. The dog's name was goat. Right, right. So they name eat. There, there's one sort of like gigantic mother dog in Skyrim who produced named Goat who produces all the. Sheep. All right, this is a stealth mission. We are here to test our two hypotheses. When discovered by enemies, random units provide a distraction like I've a smoke bomb for me to escape. And two, if I encounter difficult episode. enemies, Spawning I can spawn units to fight them instead. This is really pre and fun. God. Uh, God, I love the mind. You're fired, image Every reality. time to get sees a dog, all they can think of is how their dog milk slash cheese taste. Dog exists. Doug, I can milk you. No, I'm not like walking around thinking, like fantasizing about milking dogs. It's just something that I thought about one time of like, why isn't there dog cheese? And nobody's answered it for me in a compelling way. What do I... Like, I don't want to give the impression that this you is, like, all I think about outside of Scream. Conversations about dog cheese. That's true. Yeah, I'll, I'll walk into a room of enemies and shout, Have you guys had dog cheese? And they'll be like, dog cheese? And then while they start arguing about what type of mammal makes the best cheese, I book it through there. That's hypothesis number three. Oh my god. These poor dogs. <laughs> okay, all right, this is serious. This is a stealth mission. Calm down, calm down. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. It's like eight dogs worth. Oh, Wait, do my items... Nah, I don't need them. Jesus, Cloudy Sky Games, up. thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Pretty sure human cheese is legit. We talked about dog cheese, human milk, and bird cream. What are your thoughts on human cream? I'd put, I'd use human cream, like to smooth your skin or something like that. Um, we all know you actually took a break from YouTube because you were hunting for dog cheese. It's not like truffles. Dog cheese doesn't like, like, grow in the foresty, mossy undergrowth, and you have to like hunt for it. It comes from dogs, all right? It comes from dogs. There isn't dog cheese because it's energy inefficient. There's no point in turning grass into cow then cow into dog cheese if you can just get the cheese from the cow. Yeah, but what if it tastes really good, okay? We don't have to eat cows at all. We can just eat rice. That's, I mean, that's true of everything, right? Like any nice food. It's luxury, right? I'm not saying... Dog cheese is going to become like the common thing that everybody's eating on a daily basis. Now I figured it out. Dog spelled backwards is God, so therefore dog cheese is God cheese. Checkmate, atheist. I found an article on someone who drinks dog milk and eats dog cheese. It's real. Okay, so there's a precedent. Maybe I can email that guy and uh, he'll sponsor me. What if we interview him on stream? We get like full details about the taste of dog People cheese. People milk snakes, so where is the snake cheese? See, this is what I've been saying. Everybody calls me weird, but now you want to have snake cheese, right? So every stream goes. You start, you think I'm weird because I'm asking about dog cheese. Next thing you know, you're licking some snake's nipples.
Even if he, even if he detects me, he attacks me, create a smoke bomb of random enemies, and I fail. Okay, this is fine. As long as I don't move, create a few distractions, and now I fail. Yeah, I have a rabbit. Now, I make my way to the top. With no one the wiser. create a distraction. Have to be very quiet. Huh? Come on, come on. Okay. Pretty sure that's taken care of. Never should have come here. And here is my target. Hey, watch what you're doing. Is there a way I... Oh my god. You sick bastard. You've been milking the bees! I knew it! Oh god. I'm sorry. I didn't hurt you, Mammoth. Uh... Okay, we're fine. Alright. This guy's dead. He's who I needed to kill. Safe key... Oh, I'll take the bow. Cellar key. Queen bee statue. Okay, the mammoth is gone. Let's get you out of here. Now I just need to get out without dying. But I'm completely fucking lost. Ah! Oh, shoot! I feel like this is like a Home Alone movie. Like I'm sneaking through, throwing potatoes and leaving traps for him. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh, never mind. Okay, we're in the basement. Okay, I actually need to eat some of my, like, potato cheese. What do I need down here? Clear out Arangoth's safe. Wait, was his was his safe in his room? Or is it down here? I thought it was down it's down here, right? Also, why I definitely hear a troll. This is not good. Yo, J Dog! Thank you so much for the 24 months. Two years of my life sub to this nut so I must be insane myself. JK, happy anniversary, you glorious lunatic, smiley face. Thanks, Jado. Huh? Somehow my sneak increased for that. Alright, why don't we make, make him a friend? There you go, buddy. 
There's the safe. Bill of sale. Take some money. Don't mind if I... Oh my god! Okay. Uh, how do I leave? How do I leave? How do I leave? How do I leave? Oh! I did it! That actually went super smooth! I'm gonna say it! This 100% was true! For subscribing to Banana Facts. The Grow Michelle Banana isn't actually extinct and you can still buy them online but they're like $70 for a small box. Really? I definitely provided distractions with random enemies whenever I was found and definitely cleared out all the mercenaries outside using this mod. So far, I would argue this has helped. Good job, Dad. Another mission success with no casualties and more cheese. Except when brawling. This, it was, or except, except when talking to people. This was very, very bad. But I'm pretty happy with how this has been going. You gotta buy this. What are we going to name the bee in a jar? Well, I thought we would set him uh, free. You know, like, send him off back into the wild. It just works. Do bees need air to breathe? I just, he needs to be in the sun. No, we should put him near flowers. Okay. Next time we see flowers, we'll, we'll place uh, him there. Get the equilibrium spell, it damages you. Oh, interesting. But the rare banana. Yeah, that is actually... Please unsubscribe from banana facts. I But... That is actually super cool that the that the old banana species are still around. <clears throat> I didn't know that. I would actually love to try that. That'd be very cool. Put it in milk. I mean, look at all these flowers. This looks like the appropriate resting place for a bee. I mean, apparently they like super glued this bo this, this jar shut. At least now he can die the way he lived. Milk in these flowers. Smash the jar? I don't I don't think I can. Cut him some air holes. God, I've learned so much today. Milk him before you go. Dude, he's probably spent his whole life getting milked in that horrible mansion. I want him to live the remainder of his life resting amongst the flowers, man. Doug, you look better with a mustache. Thank you. I think it looks great, too. I was considering uh, getting rid of it, but I'll keep it now. You could have had the bee cheese market by the balls. Look, look. I have said it from the beginning. I have always said I am not going to enter the dog cheese market unless it is ethically raised dog milk. You all heard me say that, okay? I'm not going to get into some unethical, shady-ass bee milk shit, okay? I will never do that. Okay, but what breed of dog would produce the best cheese? Okay, ass oh, this is my close. Assuming it was ethical, be the ethical dog market you want to see in the world. That's true, true, true. 
Well, the product... The product name... I feel like there's there's little enough dog cheese in the world that I think the name could just be dog cheese and we would still would be fine. You don't have to differentiate yourself uh, when you are a monopoly. Corgi. Okay, again, let us assume I, I don't want to be gross and weird, all right? But... No, I don't want- I don't want to do a poll. I- I was just gonna- I was curious your thoughts on which dog would theoretically, ethically make the best tasting, uh, dog cheese. I can't have- I don't want a record of this conversation <laughs> visually. Um... Cavalier King Charles Spaniel, the king of dog cheese. A Spaniard? Mmm... You know, I feel like it- it could- a poodle. Poodles are very soft. I feel like they would have a nice uh, chocolatey aftertaste to it. 200 few people like your mustache in the poll. Nice. I'll take it. it. Does not have to be ethical. Oh my god. Look. I'm sure the early Americans with their manifest destiny wanted to just take over the whole land at whatever cost. They probably would have raised some unethical ass dog cheese farms. Okay, but we gotta be better than that. Oh, there's a chicken. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no! Uh, is there... Samoyaks is the right Oh, yeah, it would taste like marshmallows. Okay. This is bad. I gotta... Oh, it's an Ice Wraith? Alright. Trying to fight things, not a good idea. Never works out. Oh, now you could go the easy way. Can you? Doug, that moustache is amazing. With that moustache, you really remind me of the Muppets character named Floyd Pepper. I don't see that. Uh, I don't see that. It goes too far out. It would need to be like bushier. What do you mean true? That's not true at all. I don't even, how would I even imitate? It's not even remotely human looking. I need- I would need glasses or something. It's not true at all. The only similarity is that he has a mustache. Nothing else is similar. What do you mean? Even if you're one of us, you better not make trouble. Read your right. flight. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thing. The shirt. I'm wearing a blue shirt. It's not even the same shirt. And you're saying I look like a Muppet. Word on the street is Golden Glow's been hit. Have you ever Good seen Doug life. Doug and Floyd Pepper in the same room? I don't think so. Let me take a look at what you found. Aaron got so Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? <clears throat> She has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? I went ahead and made a poll for milk and dogs, and the consensus is weenie dogs would make the bet. Don't call them weenie dogs. I must ask you a question. 
How do you handle the fame of being the dad well, from inside out? I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. Well, it's not well, too now, hard because I'm anonymous. Nobody knows my name. Fire. She asked for you by name. Uh, no, nothing like that. You're calling on her for business. That's between you and Maven, and I prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. <laughs> of course, your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whiplash. Do you want us to call them dick dogs? No, right call them wiener dogs like a normal person. Nobody calls them weenie dogs. <laughs> Definitely nobody calls them dick dogs. I am... Okay, quick question. Hey, let's talk a second. No. Uh, if I stand in front of peeny dogs... If I stand in front of this guy's arrows, do you think it'll hit me? I'm assuming it's just an animation that plays, and it's not actually shooting real arrows. Real arrows. Uh, do you think this will cause something to spawn? No, don't mind me. Just keep going. Miss Peggy Milk be Pig Milk Muppet Milk or Human Hand Milk. In <laughs> combination, dude. Okay, I don't think I can. What if I stand at the target? Man, he doesn't shoot. Oh, these are real arrows. Diablo, the cheetah's dog, cheese, and mustache emporium. Okay, I guess, um... Man, those are real. You gotta time it. This would be insanely hard, so he has to pull back. Dude, come on. I also have to see which one he's aiming at. This is insane. No, I don't think they're real. Because, look, if I take all of them... Do they reappear, right? Because if they don't reappear, that means they were just sitting there. Oh shit, they do! Oh my god, okay, so I could definitely get hit by this guy. It's like a... fun game show. Oh, he's going left. Dude, he juked me! First live stream of yours I have watched, and I must say I'm not disappointed listening to you talk about dog cheese for a while. Thanks to goodest Thank doggo. Thank you so much for making this stream so great for me. Thanks. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Dude, he keeps juking me out. He he aims center, and then I go left. Look, see? Okay, so I have to double juke. I go center, left, right. Left. I don't think it fires unless... That was in, that was in, right? That hit me. Dude, I, I don't think I can do it. Dude, I, I don't know. Yeah, he's too nice. Um, got to jump. Hi, Professor. Back for another what lecture. What, what are we something? learning? Have a fan stash tick stream. Yeah, I guess I should reiterate. What if I? Oh, 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 oh! What if I'm on the other side? Hold on, this could actually work. What if I drop down onto it? Okay, he's, he's shooting. I have to time. Okay, I'm quick saving. So I have to drop down. I have to time this perfectly. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. Fucking okay, I can't do it. Hey, Fuck this hey. guy. I wanna talk to you now. Okay, on to mission number three. Weak? Dude, he I timed it. I did it when I was younger, really?
That hit, that hit, that hit. Oh, we got a jogger. Let's go. Nice. Oh, we got a free sword. We got free money. So I could sit here and just farm this all day for free money. It's another hypothesis. Um, yeah, okay. Because uh, somebody asked. So just to reiterate what we've been learning today. Okay. Thieves Guild, random enemy spawns. The, the, main, the main question of today is... <clears throat> Does this mod make stealth-based gameplay easier? And my my theory is that it does. And I would actually, I don't know how you guys feel so far. I would actually argue so far it's been easier with this. Well, sort of. The Honestly, this makes perfect sense. Missions where you don't want to kill everybody, it is not very helpful. Missions where you do, it's extremely helpful. Skyrimology 1101. Well, it's the graduate school of Skyrimology, which is... Uh, uh, 200, uh, 400 series, whichever. Anyways. And so far, I think these two theories have proven to be helpful. Uh, we got a, we got a third mission. This one is where we go into the brewery, I think. So this next one could be harder because it's not as open. And, um, I'm very curious to see how it, how it works. But what class am I? I might be in the wrong place. Look, the good news is either you're here or you're in detention. Grad classes are usually in the 500s. I thought it was 400s. I, I can't remember. You're, you're probably right. How many college credits do we get? Uh, like two. You don't get technical college credits, but uh, if you want, I'll uh, I'll get really blackout drunk and then uh, call your call the dean of your college and just kind of yell at him about Skyrim. Oh, they don't drink. Yeah. <laughs> if it was for a good cause, though. I'm not, like, morally opposed to it. I just... How many hours to get enough money to buy the house in solitude? <laughs> That's a good question, Jack. I don't know. The thing with drinking right now is it makes me feel very bad and very hungover. Hi, I just moved into my college dorm two days ago. I'm glad to be here in this stream for my first class. Good to have you, Jack. The thing is for me, I get way too hungover from alcohol now. And I don't enjoy it enough to justify, like, the enjoyment from drinking is no longer high enough to justify the pain of a hangover. Please contact my dean saying I passed my exams. Yeah, I'll call somebody. Don't worry. They might be your your college. But, like, if the scale tips up, right, even if the amount of pain stays the same, if the enjoyment I get out of drinking increases dramatically, then that equation suddenly makes sense again. Um, so, really, you just need an enticing enough offer. Only one way to find out. Why is the green screen over here kind of fucked up? Heed my words. The return of the dragons is not mere coincidence. This is one Why of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. Put down your See? dragons filled with your vile liquids. You're going and to embrace the teachings them. of the handmaiden of time. Get some fine boots. No, no, Mark. Oh, yeah. That's stylish. Kira, certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. These people must be made Your allegiance lies in the Empire. We haven't much to discuss. I don't have any business with you, so get out of my business. Am I in the wrong spot? to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. Two months only ten to go before I can interrupt everyone's stream with a crazy noise. True. Okay, here's the next part of the quest. Doug, you should do Skyrim, but for every minute you don't take damage, a value goes up, and when you do get hit, a certain number of enemies based on the value spawn. 
It's an interesting idea. I like that. Why is this part of my green screen not... Am I, is it too much light? Is it too little light? I don't understand. Oh, it's because I keep moving it, I think. Whatever. And also, what am I talking about? We're, um, <clears throat> you know, in a classroom. Alright, here's Maven Blackbriar. Here, God, here's Maven Blackbriar. So you're <clears throat> the one. Hmm. You don't look so impressive. You know how this lady is pure evil? Look at that dog cheese. Remove her from the Thieves Guild faction and murder her in cold blood. That's not a pro tip. That's just cheating. What this stream has made me think about so far today. One dog cheese. Not. Is it real this and how can we get job. it? Two good questions. Tosh is awesome. Three Doug looks like the Muppets character Floyd Pepper. How they managed to get Two of those three things made quickly. sense. Head to the Bannered Mare in Whiterun and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. Um, who runs the show? Some layabout. Been a thorn in my side for the last few... Not a day goes by. In only a few short years, he's taken that bile he calls mead to... I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market. Exactly. Then I swoop in and take over the place. No I'm more. Strike now. The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Honey? Savion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share. Bee milk. Okay, cool, One we're good. One more time in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job and you will be sorry. Someone there? Someone do something. Thought I heard something. Hey! Do something. Never should have stopped you. Have fun! Uh, yeah, that was a little more than I was. It's a little more than I was expecting. Okay, I think we're fine though. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, it's it's nothing. So anyway, now we're off to. It's a little chunky. Now we're off to. Rift then. Wait. Okay. Speak to Malice Macius. Okay, uh we're off. Shouldn't Here you we be go. on your way to White Run? Does that count as a death? That doesn't count as a death. That was a- what? That was a freak accident. Two things can you explain Twitch chat but with food and also is Twitch chat ethical in port? Lol. Wait, I didn't get High Hrothgar? Uh oh. Wait, can you... There's a prediction that you die more than ten times. Okay, well, I'm gonna fuck up the prediction. Sorry. I'll show you why in a second. I have to get to White Run really fast. I have... Oh, I have a lot of money. Okay, well, I'm still gonna try to take the Doug Doug Express instead of taking the carriage. I gotta go to White Run. I can take the carriage or... I can use speedrun strategies.
Hey Doug, this is my bi-monthly donation just to say I continue to enjoy your content and hope you continue to have a wonderful life. Thank you, Duke. That's very kind. <clears throat> I will not... My life will end in, a, in about 30 seconds, though. I'll only try it twice. Yeah, that, that looks good. All right, and now we load our quick save, and we're gonna have just a little bit of speed, and I book it all the way to Whiterun. It'll be much faster than taking a carriage. And here we go. Where, where the fuck am I? Okay, so there's Whiterun. <laughs> uh, I was pretty fast. Uh, yeah, we got pretty far. I just have to land in a body of water. Oh, so close! Okay, one more try. Wait, why I why am I back in the air? Okay, I'll land in the water. What the fuck just happened? Um Did this help? <laughs> Not really. I sort of. I I think it's about equidistant from White Run. All right, let me let me try again. Let me try again. One, one more one more horse shot, and then I will just take a carriage. Oh wait, I think it was Jorker. Somebody asked earlier about learning Skyrim speedrun. If you go to Skyrim speedrunning on. Uh, what is it? Speedrun.com. There's resources there with, like, some tutorials and stuff by Dr. T. Chops, which is how I've been learning, so. Alright. Look, for people talking- if you bet that I died ten times, don't worry. This will be my third death, and then I won't die again after this. I'll be great. You're not in third person in the save. Yeah, I am. Okay, that didn't work. Hold on. It'll be your fourth? So that's third. Uh oh. Sorry, sometimes the horse thingy doesn't work. I have to redo it. Seems essential for the Thieves Guild. This is, look, this is really important. <laughs> oh my god, that's gonna be fast. Here we go! Let's go to Whiterun. Ho! <laughs> uh, no, that's not helpful. That's, that's quite a bit, quite a bit farther than Whiterun. I can't move. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take a carriage. Although I didn't die, which means I get one more shot. This is it. This is gonna save so much time. Think of how fast I'm gonna get there. That should be good. That should actually be fast enough without killing me. Okay, I need to land in the water next to White Run. Boom. Oh, that's very fast still. Yeah, I'll just take a gamble. Here. Oh! Is that a river? No, that's a road. <laughs> For like a brief second, I was like, I did it! Fuck. All right, all right, fine. I'll walk like a boring person. Jeez. Can take me to Anadol. Where do you want to go? Uh, wait, run. Climb and back, and we'll be off. <laughs> Never been to White Run before? The Jarl's Palace is something to see. Dragons are good. 
how is this faster than fast travel? Did you see how fast I was going? Uh, I gotta... Use the, uh, dug hole, so... Why don't you guys have a quick, uh, jaunt? The Dead Dug Gambling Organization is so corrupt, I feel like I will lose my bet regardless of the outcome. Look, we don't claim to run an ethical, legitimate business here. All we claim is to run a business. Uh, cool. Left click, right click, look up, look down, look left, look right, forward, back, left, right, stop, There's jump. No shame in taking Molotov. And more boring route unless you're trying to speed run, in which case it's disgraceful. Also, big fan of both you and your brother's work. Hey, thanks, Apple. Door. Camera. F is not. That's Q now. Sprint is left shift. I switched to the controls. Crouch is caps. Okay, I guess I don't have that. Uh, okay, cool. Bathroom break. Either use the knowledge that you have learned here to test out stealth techniques or um, go pee. Is it working? You gotta right click because you can shoot some flames. Try to get some friends.
streamers asleep everyone send him good vibes and support. Attacked Applejack! Ban them! Who did it, mods? This is looking great. You guys are doing a great job. How'd it go? Did you learn a lot? <sighs> sure you- I don't know. Sure you learned... something about something. Great job. Oh, Barry! Uh... Hey, Barry, I made these slides. Thank you for the sub, Barry. Uh, hey, Barry Bebop, who just subscribed is uh, my new editor who edited the most recent video and he's wonderful and great and you should all go say hi to him and also uh, check out his Twitch channel because it's fantastic. I genuinely think that if you like my Twitch channel you would love uh, Barry Bebop's stream. It is uh, really wonderful and you're in for an experience. Um, but hello. Great job everybody. I'm sure White Run was happy to have you there. When is my next assignment? We're getting there. We're, look, we're learning things, man. How long have you had a mustache? I don't know. I don't... This is... that Okay, that question is like the ship of, of Ablesius Ephesius. Ephesius? <laughs> what is the name of that? It's not ship of feces. What? Ephesius? The ship... It's the, the philosophy question about a ship... No, it's not Odysseus. Theseus. The okay. The ship dies the better <laughs> Doug's deaths chats deaths don't count. Yeah, no, my deaths definitely do not count for the for the bet. Um no, it's not the ship of feces. It's the sh okay, it's the idea that if you go on a journey as a sh as a as a When is Daisy reveal? When uh if if you like as a crew take your ship or whatever and you sail across the ocean and the whole time that you're sailing, you're replacing individual little bits of the ship, right? Um, uh, then... Good luck editing out all our dog milk comments, Barry. Yeah, Barry, you're gonna have to edit out a lot of dog milk. You'll- you'll- you'll find out what that means. <laughs> There's a lot of dog milk to get, to get out of here. Um... Anyway, so the ship, the idea is like, if the ship is modified over time and every little piece gets replaced over time, right? That like eventually all the pieces of the ship have been replaced, but it's still the same ship, right? And so it's like a philosophical question. Is the Theseus ship the same ship or is it different, right? And I think you could apply that question to my mustache. Please explain using dog cheese. It's like if <laughs> I don't know. I guess if if the dog's nipples. No, I'm not gonna do that, Brendan. But anyway, the point the point uh, is: is my mustache like a ship of Theseus, where it's like the same mustache, or because the hairs have technically grown out and been replaced, is it a new mustache? Or you get what I'm saying? Your mustache shapes feces. No, you did not take the right... <laughs> you did not take the right lesson from that, man. What the fuck is dog milk? Well, when a mommy dog and a daddy dog love each other very much... They're gonna make a dog, they're gonna make a small dog, and then they're gonna make dog milk to feed the small dog. And it's just a simple question, alright? Everybody else... It, everybody's been asking it in the chat. I don't remember who brought it up. It was probably somebody in the chat. Um, 
The question is, could you make dog cheese? And that's all. Okay, that's all we're talking about. Ethically raised, family farm owned dog cheese. No additives, no preservatives, no horm no growth hormones. Pasture raised. All right, we're talking about good American family farm dog cheese. Uh, where do I go? I thought I was here. Oh, I have to go to White Run. Shit. Uh, I'll just reload. What is it with dog cheese? I don't know. I've been if trying to change the subject. And replace all of our body cells. Are we still the same person? Yeah, that's the question. Um. Yeah. I, I mean, I don't think there's like a correct answer to that question, right? Professor Doug, I think the best dog for cheese production would be a Great Dane because they are big. They might might as well be small planted cows. Fields of Great Danes owned by ranchers would produce Great Dane milk for the good people of the community. For the good American farmer. I've been buying. So what you were saying is because of the ship of feces, that's why there is a turd on your face. And that the more turds your nose produces, no, is it the same turd? No, this is not- this has nothing to do with feces. Firstly, my first stream of yours love your YouTube. Secondly, Barry, I will sub to you if you keep the dog cheese in. <laughs> you can't- don't threaten my editor with- <laughs> don't bribe him! <laughs> I know you're saying dog milk, but my brain keeps hearing dog milk. Hold on, I'm trying to find a picture. One sec. Dude, family owned... Hold on, sorry. This is taking a while. Every seven years or ten, depending okay, here we go, here we go. story you hear, we become essentially new people because in a time every cell in your body has been replaced by a new cell. T.I.L. Oh, actually, I did know that. Do cats understand the concept of clothes? There's no way of knowing. Um, here's what I'm imagining. Okay, because, like, recently I started buying pasture-raised eggs, which you all should do as well, because pasture-raised is when they're actually, like, more ethical. Um, but I'm like looking for, for like ethically raised eggs now and all the ones that are ethically raised, they're like way more expensive, right? Um, but they all like want to make a point of how like well they treat their chickens, which is fair, right? Um, but, but they all like have images and pictures of like, oh, here's us on our family farm. And it's like the, the one I recently bought is like a girl like holding a chicken and like looking at the like looking at the camera. It's just it's really cheesy and over the top. So what I'm imagining, though, when you're talking about like family dog farms, <laughs> her like holding up a Great Dane, like a little girl looking I with with pigtails and a bow tie. And it's adorable. Do not make dog cheese from dog milk. Again, I'm trying to change the subject. You guys keep bringing up dog cheese. Oh yeah, I should. I don't think I said his name. It's that twitch.tv slash Barry like a berry, and then Bebop, and uh, he is a human berry, <laughs> like this. Anyway, that that's how you spell it. Oh, this is how you spell it. Embrace the dog cheese dog. No, I've been trying to change the subject for like three hours. You guys are just gross. Does he have dog? No, 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 no. Hold on. Look, we're... Hold. City's closed with the dragons about. There's no need to worry about the this current state of dog cheese. We moved past it. An eye on you. Please acknowledge you started it. I nobody knows. There's a lot of people throwing around ideas. Could have been anybody. 
Okay, in, in terms of the actual game, I have one more mission that I want to do normally, and then I want to try a passive mission and see if I can beat an entire mission without attacking at all. Which is actually similar to what I've done already. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we've already proven that. I don't... Does anybody remember? Did I attack at all in the last mission? Because if not, we've already proven Does that. Does that mean we can have dog sour cream? <laughs> can you? I don't... What is sour cream made out of? You attacked Arangoth. Oh, yeah, yeah. I did. I did. I did. And that actually would have been a lot harder if I hadn't been able to attack him. So, okay. So I'm going to do one more mission where I'm allowed to attack. Then I will try a mission of total passiveness. And then we'll... Make it so if anybody is hit all the time, it will spawn somebody. Uh, and that will crash the game. And probably my stream. I feel like you should make a disclaimer to not actually milk your own dogs. Look, I am not advocating for dog milk. We are just... It's a philosophical question, okay? I need to be very clear here. Nobody should be making dog milk until they figure out how to do it ethically. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have Quick more question after editing out any and all dog milk slash cheese order. slash butter slash cream. Will you have enough footage for a video? I don't know. I think there's a little bit of Skyrim in here. What about dog chocolate? Choc dogs don't Come produce chocolate. What are you talking about? Okay. You must Who needs dog cheese, cheese when we could have wallaby cheese, cheese instead? Can't a man drink in peace? Another man who indulges in dog cheese. I'm gonna keep this short because we've got a lot. Like if I was to bring you some dogs, dogs would you help me milk them and make dog cheese? No. Tasting White Run's captain of the guard. And we're going to poison the mead. Look. I don't want to taste that forbidden fruit unless we know for sure it was raised ethically. No, no, that's the beauty of the whole plan. We're going to unless I see a picture of a little girl with pigtails holding up a dog and looking cute at the camera, I don't trust you. Past poison and meat don't mix with You're going to Okay, I actually need to pay attention. I don't remember this. He's going to give you the poison to use on the pests, but you're also going to dump it into the brewing vat. Okay. Maven and I spent weeks planning this. All we need is someone like you to get in there and get it done. Should do a mod where we control attack and jump and you control movement. Brain and hire yep. someone else um, I could do that at some point. Work. All Skyrim cheese wheels are dog cheese. You can't change my mind. Once Sabjorn is out of the way, Maven has plans for the place. One way or another, we don't want the pests coming back. You can't prove even if it was a that it's not. What modifications would be farms need to farm dog milk? You need to clear them out. Look, I don't have all the answers here about dog cheese. I just have questions. Remember, Sabjorn will be needing a helping hand. Make it look good. A very uh, deceased looking person. You're supposed to be at the meadery. If it's work you're looking for, hold it. Dog yogurt. Okay, apparently some people weren't here for the original discussion about dog cheese. Just as a quick summary, we've agreed that it would be called dogger. Professor Daga, I have a question. Could you please define ethical and how far can I stretch the definition? Look, I don't want a legal trail. <laughs> tracing me to someone who started an unethical dog farm. I don't, I don't know. I've only got questions. I, I'm a man of curiosity. What about bear milk? What the fuck? I came back and you're still talking about this. No, we stopped for a little bit, but then people... Start I it again. It's a bit late to avoid a legal trail. Uh, this is all a deep fake, though. I didn't say any of this. Do 
Twitch chat takes an IQ test. Is there a mod where all the animals yeah. are made of cheese and all the cheese is made of animals? <laughs> I don't know how to retexture things, but that would be funny. That would be, I feel like be in line with my kind of content. I'm back, Doug. Hello. Um, can I go pee or something? It's been like three hours. What are no. you gawking at? Can't you see I have Wait until next stream. Here? Okay, let's do it. Are you kidding me? Look at this place. I'm supposed okay, to be holding so if you acquire milk the from a human with consent, does it count guy. as vegan? If he sees the meadery in this state, I'll be ruined. Might be able to help. Oh, really? And I don't suppose you just do it out of the kindness of your heart, would you? I hope you're not expecting to get paid until the job's done. That's the only operate. Well, that's not how I operate, so forget it. Oh. My only demand is that these vermin are permanently eliminated before my reputation is completely destroyed. I bought some poison. Cool, got poison. I was going to have my lazy, good-for-nothing assistant malice Hot handle. tub stream, but it's but dug, dug in a giant font to set. If you plant this in the vermin's nest, it should stop them from ever coming back. Cool. Got a deal. Don't come back until every one of those things are dead. Okay, I have a question. I know I'm trying to get... Nobody wants to keep talking about dog cheese. We're all on the same page. That being said... What is man... Ma mayonnaise is made out of eggs, right? Is Doug the new McCraker like Alex Jones? Doug will not rest until he finds out the truth about the dog milk and whether or not you can make dog cheese out of it. It's an emulsion of oil, egg yolk, and an acid. So you're saying we can make lizard mayonnaise. Has anybody had ostrich mayo? Ostrich, because you can buy ostrich eggs. That's got to be a thing, right? Okay, Kraft is trying to get in here. No. Ostrich eggs produce, oh, Sp Stardew Valley has, I guess. Snake mayonnaise? That'd be so badass if I had snake mayonnaise. Again, if if we find a source of ethical snake mayo, I would have that for a punishment in the next Skyrim stream. That that would be good. Okay, let's do it. So no, I gotta poison the rats for this guy. What should our child crawl through be his tunnels, Doug? and then we're good. Uh, probably Doug. Craft wants to know my current location. They'd probably hire me because of my great LinkedIn. Poison the rat milk. Yeah, it's true. Uh-oh. Okay, so... Okay, the mission has started, and there's a dragon and a werewolf already. And I accidentally quick-saved while the werewolf was out. So, we're locked in. <laughs> um... Uh, I think I just run? I mean... Really, it's the same hypothesis, except I'm just sprinting the entire time, dropping smoke bombs constantly. Here we go. Oh my god. Alright, that's fine. Okay, the big issue here is because of these small tunnels... If, if enemies spawn in the tunnels, I will not be able to get through. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, that's a... Is that a walrus? Okay. It's just fine. Okay. It's it's so hard to see. Oh, I hit a bear trap. I made a mammoth. Shit. 
That's not fair, dude. Wolf milk slash cheese with that outdoorsy flavor. There we go. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Okay, a lot of friends back here, but they're distracted with each other. So now I bail. I just can't let enemies clog up the tunnels. Oh my god. Where is it? Okay. You hear the spiders? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, gotta fight our way through. Oh, Nazim, I'm sorry. <laughs> Nazim spawned in front of me mid swing. Couldn't you make snake maze out of snake oil and snake eggs? You make both snakes with one layer. True. Okay, attempt three. Oh, there's a lot of a lot of friends already. <laughs> oh my god! Alright, the tunnel's clogged. Uh, this way's blocked. Doing construction on the highway. Okay. This is fine. I just need to be fast. Okay, I'll leave a smoke bomb here. Oh my god, that's a big smoke bomb. Ooh, very big smoke bomb. Oh my god. Okay, I'm getting pinned. <laughs> I need he I need healing. I need healing. Uh, okay. I'm switching to healing. Oh my god. Oh, I've been poisoned too. That's not good. Okay, have I gotten far enough away? Maybe they don't see me anymore. I think we're okay. Oh! No! No, we're not! No, we're not! Oh no, they blocked the path. Okay. This is fine. Okay. This is a mess. But I have an idea. I live about an hour away from the town of Cheddar. I think they would be very mad if they heard this dog cheese talk. They'd probably be super into it. They love dogs. Hey, Doug, this seems bad. To quote Alan Watts, we are all part of the game. Milk. May it be from a dog skunk or grandmother. To be of which from we are inherited our age and social abstraction depict the curdled nature to which we become. May it be a breed from dog cheese, skunk cheese or cheese from grandmas. months of making me laugh and cry. Keep up the hilarious content, Douglas. Thanks, Sea Shock. Okay. From this tunnel, we can definitively say spawning enemies does not work as a smoke grenade if you're in close quarters. Because the tunnels will just fill up with bears. 
but new hypothesis i can draw the enemies out of the tunnels before i go in i stand in a big open room draw them towards me create a big smoke grenade and then i move through tunnels i'm, I'm gonna be like a centipede moving through one at a time diablo the cheeser right i think this makes sense right so in those bigger rooms I'll sit in there and create enough of a distraction that they won't follow after me. No, what do you mean no? This is brilliant. You will die. No, because they start attacking each other. The issue is when I'm trying to get through a specific spot. You're fucked. I am smart and I'm not fucked. And I'll prove it. Uh, with some loud ass guilty gear music. Three, two, one. Time to test. Okay, so there's enemies in that tunnel. So instead, I wait out here. I cause a big fucking distraction like that. And now I go in. Okay, once again, big room, big distraction. Okay. I have to remember, I have to remember the bear trap. I must not go in the bear trap. Okay, create a big distraction in here, right? Big distraction, big distraction, big smoke grenade. Now I go in. Okay, lots of guys out here. Big smoke grenade, big smoke grenade. All right, that works, that works. Okay, there's a bear trap here. I can't, there it is. Create a few. Perfect. Perfect. Who the fuck are you? Okay, whatever. Have a smoke. Okay. <laughs> this is a big smoke grenade. It's really distracting. Now I go here. I poison. I take this chest. Okay. Oh my god. And we go. Holy shit, I'm at the top. Huh? Ah! 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 No! No, 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 Where's the bat? Where's the bat? How do I poison it? How do I poison it? Okay, I poisoned it. And the bear is dead. Oh, 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 okay. What, what did you keep? Why do I need the key? So you're so Jesus, like take the wheel. Now I clear the last of the smoke grenade. Oh, he's regenerating health, fuck. That's mission three done. I don't know, man. I think with this most recent hypothesis, this has continued to help me in stealth-based missions. How many deaths was that? That was like nine, right? I keep, why do I keep saying smoke grenades? Smoke bomb. 
quest isn't done? Was something we discussed unclear? Well, it's about time. Doug, I wish you the I best. To the but please, quote unquote, stay the heck away from my quote unquote <laughs> dog. You will quote unquote not milk her during her prime milking stages for your wanna... cheese production. I'm not trying to wink, milk wink, any... you sick, sick man. Quote unquote. Not trying to milk anybody's dog. You'll just have to wait until after the captain's finished. I suppose you can wait around if you must. All right. Unless I get hit during this, which I guess I could. Well, Sabjorn, now that you've taken care of your little pest problem, how about I get a taste of some of your mead? Help yourself, my lord. It's my finest brew yet. I call it Hunting Brew Reserve. I think you'll find it quite pleasing to your palate. Oh, come now. This is mead, not some wine to be sipped and savored. By the eight. What? What's in this? I... I don't know. What's wrong? You assured me this place was clean. I'll see. See to it that you remain in irons for the rest of your days. No, please. I don't understand. Silence, idiot. I should have known better to trust this place after it's been riddled with filth. I don't understand. I beg what... you, please. This is not what it seems. How did he... So he... Whatever. He's lactose intolerant. <laughs> You, you're in charge here until I can sort this all out. It will be my pleasure. And you, you're coming with me to Dragon's Reach. Found your channel last week and it reminded me posing can be fun sometimes, so work no. is chill again. Also Move. name my cat, thank you, bye. Look, I assure you this is Thanks, all just a kid. huge misunderstanding. Um, okay, hear me out. Cat name. No, I, was, I don't want to bring up dog cheese again. Um, sweet roll. It's a good one. Hey, move. Farewell, Sabjorn. Assuming you want a Skyrim themed cat. I don't think about to let Doug love anywhere. you, you don't have to say it back. Anything they else never you say need it back. You head back to Rifton? <laughs> Thank you. Need a good look at Sabjorn's so, books. Maven wants to hunt down Sabjorn's private partner, huh? She's You're roll. welcome to take a look around Sabjorn's office. He keeps most of his papers stashed in his desk. Here, this should help. Um. Start changing it over to the Blackbriar Meadery Well. She's put me in charge. If you're in the area, and you ever need anything fenced, you just let me know. Cool. Uh, now what? I go up here? Remember to put in a good word with Maven for me. Where the hell is the stairs? Here are the stairs. Huh. Mystery note. Cool. I think we're good. Uh, we go back to Riften. AFK. What? No, the AFK deaths don't count. That's not me. Wasn't the poll how many times I die? That would be very dumb. <clears throat> you gave us control. Has it already been decided? Yeah, less than 10 deaths. Tell you what. I'll flip you for it. It's Tails. Gonna get cold tonight. Might want to at least cover your delicate. You're a stranger here too, huh? I don't have any business with you, so get out of my face. You've never seen me old this upset about anything. The city really you has have to some come. nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. Alright. I trust you have good news for me. 
Job's finished. Here's the information. The only thing that could identify Sabion's partner is this odd little symbol. Yes, I've seen that symbol before. Well, whoever this mysterious marking represents, they'll regret starting a war with me. You should bring this information to the Thieves Guild immediately. There's also the matter of your payment. I believe you'll find this oh, more she's gonna pay me in milk. for your services. Iron dat why would that whatever. Out of my way. Cool. Well that's mission number three. In which easy Nathan Milk. Um, okay, that's, that's three missions. That's three missions. I think... I think we've proven our point. Last one is I want to try a mission that's passive. No attacking. I don't know what the next mission is. But absolutely no attacking to reinforce the point even further. Although I think, I think my hypothesis holds true at this point. And then we'll uh, crank up the mod a bit. Cool. Might want to get a stealthy follower. No, no, because the whole point Working of this test is to tough. prove that the mod helps enough that I don't need anybody to do anything offensive. Oh, wait, I don't have to go out here. Passivism is a sign of weakness. No, dude, if you can stop, if you can win a mission, literally without exerting yourself in the slightest, that's sick. It's a power move. How are you gonna kill the last monster? You spawn. Well, that's the thing, I have to just leave him. It's called passive aggression. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be passive aggressive. And we'll clear it out. Oh, can I get hit? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. on the street is that poor Sabjorn has found himself in White Run's prison. How unfortunate for him. Exactly. Now you're beginning to see how our little system works. Maven sent word that you discovered something else. Something did the if I say dragon then dragon spawn stream what I, what I did is that the keys on my keyboard will spawn things and uh, I didn't turn that off I think I, I think I pressed one of the, I think I pressed one of the keys Cool. Wow, I don't even know what button that was. I dropped my pen. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot about that raid. 
Yo, Raspberries, thank you so much for the uh, raid. Welcome, everybody. Welcome to uh, Skyrim. Just some normal ass Skyrim. Uh, I'm just quickly Jesus, testing something. Take the wheel. Uh, I don't know. Is it like N? What button did I press? Is it like the numpad? Ah! Oh! Yes, it's the num it's the numpad. These are set up. Oh my god. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> um <clears throat> Welcome everybody, what's up? Uh I am playing Skyrim, but every time I'm hit a random enemy appears, which is different from if I accidentally <laughs> touch my keyboard in a certain spot, uh, things bad things happen. Um, okay, next part of the Thieves Guild quest. Word on the street is that poor Savion found himself in White Run's prison. How unfortunate for him. Exactly. Now you're beginning to see how a little. I'm concerned about the people raiding. Nathan sent word yeah. that he discovered something else while you were out there. Something important to the game. How do you submit art for Rosa? DougDug.com slash for Rosa. What keyboard do you have? No, no, no. I didn't like buy a keyboard that does that. Just It's just a keyboard. You don't need this keyboard. But you need the mod that does it, right? Just so we're clear. Then this is beyond coincidence. First Arangoth. At least we aren't talking about dog milk anymore. Why you gotta Someone's bring up dog cheese? To take us down by driving a wedge between Maven and the game. We haven't talked about dog cheese in like over two minutes, and you're ruining that that beautiful little moment we had. Although I think if I one of the buttons on my keyboard spawns cheese. Mercer thinks he knows a way to identify. Dog us cheese is back, outside. Pog. He wants to meet with you right away, and if oh. I were you, I'd hurry. I've never seen him this angry before. Um. I do like the idea that you guys just sat around depressed, waiting for the ability to talk about dog cheese again. Alright, next quest ah, is... There you are. I've consulted my contacts regarding the information you recovered from Golden Glow Estate, but no one can identify that symbol. Uh huh. It would seem our adversary is attempting to take us apart indirectly by angering Maven Blackbriar. Very. Clever. Dugo's freshest frozen dogurt, dogurt in town. Um, maybe we should recruit Just, them. But they've been able to avoid identification for years. They're obviously well funded. Driven, How do you do a pen spin? This is just the simple one. You can YouTube just it. Don't mistake my admiration for complacency. Our nemesis is going to pay dearly. How can we make them pay? Because even after all their posturing and planning, they've, they've made, made a, mistake. a mistake. The parchment you recovered mentions a godgel. Oh, lie. this one. Uh, Pretty this isn't even like a hard. Alias this is literally a full contacts. stealth mission, right? His real name is Gollum I. Slimy bastard. Like this one, you just follow the dude through the warehouse. I don't Gullum think I actually have to fight. Inside man at the East Empire Company in solitude. I'm betting he acted as a go-between for the sale of Golden Glow Estate and that he can finger our buyer. Mercer sucks because his dog cheeses in free range. Talk to Brignol At the end, they're a bandits. Okay, so I have to... Okay, that'll that'll be good then. So it'll be a short one. It'll work with my hypothesis. Okay. Um, cool. Now I go to Solitude. Come here a second. Nope, don't care. Wait, where's the exits? I always get lost here. There. I can't believe Gullum Eyes mixed trouble. <laughs> He's... You're going to have, if that fails, follow him and see what he's up to. If I know Gollum I, he's, I'm glad to see you're embracing our method. Just keep on Gollum I's tail, and he's bound to step into something he can't scrape off his boot. Okay. Good you luck need in marksman solitude. training. And we go. Let's do it. Cat will be cheddar in honor of dog cheese. <laughs> that is it. Cheddar is actually a great cat name. It's a very adorable cat name. 
Happy we could help. Doug, you responded to my chat. I'm going to flex now. I actually, I have an idea. This is a great idea. Okay. I think, um, you know how people, whenever, like, you're in Twitch chat, there's, like, a big achievement or somebody, like, somebody, like, wins Did a big, like, a tournament. To a Bay Aquarium? I'll answer that in a sec. There's, like, a big tournament or, you know, a big challenge or speed run or something that they get. And then, as it's happening, like, people, like, are, are building up that big moment where they, like, get a world a record or whatever. That you might be interested in. BTW, I'm sorry. Okay. Um... And then one of my favorite messages is when people spam, I was here. And that's so funny to me that it's like, I was here. Um, and like, what I like, or like, hi, YouTube and stuff. And what I like to imagine is that like all the people who are saying that are like, man, everybody who watches this on YouTube is going to be so proud of me. Like, I was here. And so I thought we should like go to a random video, maybe of mine, and find somebody in the chat who said, I was here when I like beat a challenge or whatever. And we like find the timestamp of the YouTube comments. And then I'll leave a comment on that video that's like whoa like you know doggo 420 whoa you were here man great fucking job and then all of us like and comment on that thing we just try to make him feel like as cool as he thought it would be that he was there anyway i guess if somebody finds if somebody finds a person in one of my videos who said that where we can make a big deal about them um let me know because i feel like that'd be fun and nobody would like know, or this is not like this has no consequence. All right, dog cheese is available for thirty-three hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you gave me chest hair? <laughs> I need to have cute pigtails for this to really to really feel like a family farm. Why are there cows? That's the old way. DairyDoug.com? What is this? Hold on. This is... Did you... <laughs> Did you buy DairyDuck.com? <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're in early access. We might not have the recipe for dog cheese yet. I'm like Plankton. I'm opening up the chum bucket. And we'll figure out the secret. We'll steal the secret recipe from Mr. Krabs for dog cheese. Um, okay, I gotta go to Solitude. Wait, do I have to take the carriage to Solitude, or could I, could I fly there? Okay, I get three tries. I get three tries. I get three tries. Hey, thanks, Max. Max. That's pretty far. And eh, that'll be good. All right, check this out. First try. And he's off. Wait, I actually think that's solitude. That was. I don't. That's all. Wait. How close am I? I actually got kind of close. That was not bad. I mean, this would take like 10 minutes to walk, so I'm still going to reset it. But that was not bad. Hold on. Let me reset the quick... Let me set a marker so I can actually see where to go.
I'll try two more times and then I'll just... Yeah, Solitude docks. Exactly. Like, I have a great landing spot. I'll try two more times. That's fast. No, I'll... Um... I'm gonna redo. I'm gonna redo. I, I I can't have like insane amounts of speed, or I will just overshoot. That looks good. You can see him at the top right of the screen. You can see my legs poking out the bottom. That's a good amount of speed. Not too much. Check out the milk. Okay. Excuse me. That's solitude, right? Oh, 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 don't land in the... Oh, come on! I was right there! Okay, one more. I was here. <laughs> you don't say that if I fail. I'll do that. Not as fast. Little slower. That is not fast enough. Uh, I'll land in this. Did I make it? No. <laughs> no, no. <clears throat> not even close. We're like a third of the way. It wasn't bad. Okay. Dog cheese has 800,000 searches. That's not us. Unless somebody like started DDoSing dog cheese. Like, that's not us. I was here. Oops. Why can't I talk to you? Uh-oh. What is happening? I can take you to any of the... Where do you want to go? Uh... Climb and we'll be off. I was here for 800,000 dog cheese searches. First time to solitude? Beautiful old Beautiful city. Old city. Sure oh, shit. Sorry, I missed that earlier prime. Yes. Quick, uh, quick, another sidetrack. Um, if you remember, I'm one of the best uh, Peggle speedrunners in the world. However, I also announced that whoever is last place at Peggle at any given time on the speed run leaderboard will be a VIP in the channel. And I believe, I know it's been a week and a half since I've been online, but I believe we have a new contestant for the last place Peggle speed run. World record's an hour. I'm up here, two and a half hours. And Jay Diggity Dog. With a 15 hour run. How do I watch it? Did you open up Pog 2? <laughs> part 1 of 2. Second part is here. Bold move to include the OBS of you recording the game. Okay, so this is five hours. When do you actually beat the game? Are you watching me? <laughs> okay. Okay, so is this when you stopped?
Like around here, right? Okay, so you, you pause the game at three and a half hours. And then... <laughs> I, I can't believe they're approving these. You are bla You have two YouTube videos, the second... <laughs> the second of which is just ten hours of nothing. And then... <laughs> Peggle is like barely even on your screen. It's like a very small, it's a very small percentage of your computer. Oh my god. This is... I want to see the last shot. That was a cool last shot. In only 15 hours, 30 minutes, congratulations. At this point, beating this. That is not. Beating. God, I'm trying to copy your name. Whatever, I'll just write it. J Diggity Dog. Congratulations. I was here. <laughs> but now I need to un un VIP Goma. Sorry, Goma. But hey, you had a good run. Like two weeks. This took a while. Yeah, but it's unlikely you'll be dethroned anytime soon. But I'll at least leave you as VIP until the next time I stream that you're dethroned. So maybe I'll get sick again. Um, what was I going to say? At this point, beating J Diggity Dog's run. <laughs> this is getting to the point of like, it's, you would have to like, you you have to like use, leave your computer recording for a long enough period that it is like, inconvenient like you have to like plan your day around this you can't just leave it on overnight or something like i think goma did this is now getting very intense you need right you need a good pc you need a shitload of storage space justice for jay what do you mean he's vip in the channel what are you talking about worse than farming bitcoin yeah true He is here. He's right here. You see him in the in the chat. Okay, let's do this mission. No, I know. I'm, like, there's almost no doubt he slept during the speed run. The th the what I'm saying though is, if you, now that we're like at 15 hours, right? Let's say you sleep for eight hours. That's like fucking seven more hours that your computer is dedicated to the speedrun. So if this starts getting even longer, where we're talking about like 24 hour speedruns, this is like really inconvenient. You really got to commit to it. All right. They can't hurt Uncle Rog here. Tell them he didn't do it. Position. Far you need to go home. Uh, we got to find our boy. I think not sub 24 hours is possible. <laughs> Throw it on my mining PC and a few terabytes of storage. Yeah, Jmar, if you want to just grab the record and hold on to it forever, you can do that. Watch the execution. We'll watch it after. Um, okay, this is the fourth mission. This is the one I'm going to try to do completely passively. And I think so, it's doable. There's only do a little bit of fighting here? at the end. Hmm. Let me guess. I don't deal in land or Oh, problem. I know about this now, lizard. If you're looking for goods. You've come to the right person. Oh, wait. Did you say Golden Glow Estate? Uh, my apologies. 
I'm sorry to say I know very little about that uh, bee farm, was it? You maybe acted as a broker. Maybe, maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Can't, I can't be expected expect to remember every deal I handle. Every deal I handle. I don't care what you promise. If I tell you the buyer's name and word gets around, it can ruin me. Hasn't Mercer Frey taught you people anything? You kill me, and your only contact with the East What would it take to identify the buyer? Now, now that you mention it, there is something I've been trying this to This quest is a real pain? Out. Nah, it'll be fine. I have a buyer looking for a case of Firebrand wine. It just so happens to be a single case of Blue Pap. Bring it to me, and we'll talk about Golden Glow Cool. State. I go steal some wine. This will be easy. Is Rogvir dead? Rogvir's dead. Yeah, you were all here. You were here. I'm getting my 2004 PC from the garage in 32 gigs. See you in the next hour. 32 gigs is not enough, just so you know. I guess it depends what you record at. But, I mean, I record... I guess I record a little bit higher quality than you would. I record at, like, 10,000 or 12,000 kilobits. Um, so, like, a normal stream for me is, like... 40 gigs, something like that. That's like a five, six hour stream. So if you're talking about 24 hours, you're looking at like 200 gigs, let's say. Even if you reduce the quality a lot, you're looking at like 100 gigs. 32 gigs is not enough. You got to invest in hard drives. Oh yeah, sneaky. Is it? Okay. What if you record it on VHS and send it in to be reviewed? You watch some Barry Bebop? Nice. He is wonderful. Naked. Oh, sorry. Naked, naked. Guess what? I was here. I chiseled in my speedrun on stone tablets and sent it to the reviewers. Oh. <clears throat> All 3.5k need a shout out. You were here. You should see me when you get bored, stranger. You look new. I'm new too. I think we could be friends. <laughs> This is a nice mix we got going on in the chat. People saying that they were here. People saying naked, this naked, naked. People talking about dog cheese. We all know and love. <clears throat> I'm shocked that anybody ever checks out my stream and is then like, yeah, I think I'll stick around. <laughs> this place feels good. <laughs> I like what's going on in here. Yeah. <clears throat> like it's utter fucking nonsense. Ah, I see you have the wine. Okay, got the wine. Good. Can't have the buyer getting impatient and looking elsewhere for this, can we? Here, take this. I certainly can't use it, but I suppose I need to pay you something for the goods. Not at all. I consider it an investment, prolonging my life. As far okay. as Golden Glow Estate goes, I'll tell you what I know. I was approached by a woman who wanted me to act as the broker for something big. She flashed a bag of gold in my face and said all I had to do was pay Aaron Goth for the estate. Okay. I brought in the coin. I actually need to pay attention to this because I don't remember this quest. Did she say why she was I doing this? not to ask too many questions when I'm on the job. I'm sure you understand. However, I did notice she was quite angry. It was being directed at Mercer Frey. In this business, we rarely deal in names. Our identity comes from how much coin we carry. Okay. I think you're lying. Look, that's all I know. I never promised you I'd have all the answers. Now, since our transaction is done, I'll be on my way. Okay, now I have to... Oh, this is actual sneakery. 
Seems there's always so at this point, I need to follow this lizard guy all the way through his hideout to the very end. And I can't attack anything. It's perfect. If you need a good rumor or two, I think I can oblige. Glad you decided to check us out. This mission is actually tough. It'll be fine. I'm passive. To be clear. I cannot attack. And I would even argue I shouldn't heal. Like, I, I feel like I shouldn't be able to do anything other than exist and spawn enemies when I'm hit. Although I can level up. Maybe I can level up my stealth. Uh, stay, I'm not sure. Okay. My sneak's already pretty good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. How am I the third top donator? He's donated that much, I guess. Cheese explosion every time you cast a healing spell. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Someone should do a 24-hour speedrun and cheat at some point. What? What do you mean? Thanks, Wet Rain. Appreciate it. Is it the start of a successful lactose career? Combine every Skyrim challenge so far. I don't think that would work. See, all the Skyrim challenges I've done have... Like, towed the line very narrowly between this is an interesting way to play the game and this is just a total mess. Right? And that line is really important to cross. Because if it's just a total mess, then it's not, it's not particularly compelling for more than, you know, three minutes. Um, and that's with one of my mods. Combining all of them would be like running a mile past that line. But it would be funny for three minutes. <clears throat> Dude, this is gonna... If you're gonna toe the line, do it in your room. <laughs> I'm in my house, alright? You're the one watching me. Um, bam. Make it a YouTube short. Yeah, I could. I don't know. What do you guys think about YouTube shorts? Are you guys watching them? Here's it. Wait. I am. Can we do a poll? Can, can mods do a poll? How much, how many of you guys watch any TikTok or YouTube shorts? Because at this point, YouTube Shorts is just TikTok. Um, I'm curious, because I'm being told that it's like really important. Like Shorts are becoming like super massive um, on YouTube, but obviously TikTok's also massive as well. I don't currently do either of them. I don't watch them or make them. Um, but theoretically, I could try to. I guess it would just be like clips of streams, not like I'm gonna go start being a funny TikToker or something. Oh yeah, Umbu, you're hold on. When did I unmod you? Alright, you're remodded. Occasionally Okay, so like fifty percent of people are watching. I mean I feel like a shitload of people watch TikTok, right? That has to be a large percentage of Internet users. Doug's vids get uploaded to TikTok, do they? I'm on TikTok waits. Okay, it's like 50% of people. I don't know. I I could. I'm not particularly interested in them. Um, it will keep its hands to itself, yes? 
Not not even not not from like a oh TikTok sucks like it's just kids. I, I'm not hating on the content, even though if you don't like the content, that's fine. Um, what is it's it, it's you... just literally like the format. I don't think is particularly interesting for what I do, because I'm generally not just like throwing out hilarious jokes. It's more like I think the stuff that I do that is the most interesting it has like an arc of some kind. And so, the idea of condensing that into like 60 seconds, like some people can do that really well, you know? Uh, like ProZD, for example, or like Gus Johnson, like those guys are fucking hilarious, right? So those guys are great for shorts. Um, or YouTubers where you're, you're just like cracking jokes, like then I think it, it can totally make sense, but for me it doesn't feel like as much of a fit, so then I'm like, okay, do I want to like spend the time to... I don't know, wonton soup is pretty funny, true, true, true. I have a business case, you develop a TikTok clone, but it's focused around dairy and the apps would be dairy dugs. So quick sparse, your takeaway from this is that I should make a competing app and it's dairy focused. Ugh. Okay. I don't think it fits you. I again I'm not I'm not trying to like hate on anybody who uses TikTok. I think it's very cool. Uh as a medium for people to create certain types of content. Um I'm just not convinced that, like, I would be a good fit for it. So, I don't know. I, I, I don't have, like, a, I'm not making a decision or anything right now. I was just curious what people thought. TikTok seems to be based on short-term humor. Yeah, and that's fine. There's a lot of people who can do that really, really well. I don't know. And maybe there's a... Maybe it gets to a point where I just upload, like, Twitch clips or something. You know, like, the top Twitch clips, and it's, like, just that much. But... Uh, I definitely would not switch over to that style exclusively, but I think it's a matter of, like, should I invest some time into that sort of thing? And in fact, funny enough, one of the videos, I think it gets classified as a short... ...is on the second channel. Like, <laughs> this, this Skyrim How to Assassinate the Emperor one has like two million views randomly. I was like, why? Like, what the fuck? Uh, and I think it's because of this. I think shorts just get pushed really hard. Oh. I think funny Twitch clips would be good. Yeah, maybe I'll look into it or, or test it or something. What I find funny about you is you use clickbait as actual video premises. Yeah. Anyway. Oh. Let's beat this mission. Once again. Let me pull up the slides. I believe that we have proven the two main hypotheses. My goal now is to beat a mission without attacking or healing or anything to prove that this mod is so advantageous that even fundamental gameplay is obsolete. Bam, that's a good way to put it. Here we go. Also, I don't remember what happens in this. Oh, I paused alerts. When did I do that? DV Cameron, thank you so much. Is this supposed to be a goat? I'll be renaming my cat dog Cheese. You were here. Look, I would be honored to be named Dog Cheese if I was a cat. Still waiting for my apology. It's coming. Can you explain Skyrim but with Dog Cheese? Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this lizard. Surely, if the guy's name squeeze is Squeeze his nipples. 420, I'll just try to milk it. I 
I was here. How do I get over this? You were here. You were here. Oh god. On your Skyrim dungeon with voice commands video someone by the username of Fawny said I was here. Okay, sorry. I will, I will look at that in a sec. I'm just trying to... Jesus, take the wheel. Must be my imagination. Thank you, Clear Fog. I appreciate it very much. Sorry that... Is someone there? No, nobody's here. Hey, Doug. Currently last place in Peckle with 15 hours and wondering if I could get VIP. Love your videos and streams. Sure Keep up the great work. I was here and very proud of myself. I'm here for you and your failures and your successes, Doug. I was here. You were here. How far does this person come? Oh my god. This is actually tense as fuck. Where's my lizard boy? Is he over here? Yeah, he's over Can there. I get some dog cheese pock in chat? Wait, what do I do? Do I follow I him? What do I do at this point? I have hard drive just lying around. Don't tempt me. I don't want to fuck this up, because I- this is insane that I'm doing this first try. Or maybe it's not that insane, but it feels insane. What do I do? Do I just hold back? Okay. Can I get dog cheese in chat? Second try. Uh oh. Nothing. I guess I was just hearing things. Detected? We come for the dog cheese and stay for the naked. Just joined, what did I miss? Nothing. Is someone there? We're hunting dog cheese. Nothing to worry about. Now go in. stream I've tuned into, and yeah, this chat feels very welcoming. I think he'll stick around. Look at the chat right now. This, this is welcoming. People are screaming. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel. I'm gonna save. Huh? Oh! Uh, okay. So. Oh! Oh, I spawned a chicken. Oh my god. Stood in a bear trap and it only spawned a chicken. They are important for the algorithm, but they are just regurgitated TikTok content. Again, I have to be completely passive in this mission. So what I'm gonna do... Is I'm gonna let them hit me. I stand here willingly. I create a tiger. I run from the tiger. <laughs> um, I let the bandit and this wolf deal with the tiger. I move on. What was that? Uh, hello. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I have not attacked. I haven't done a thing. I don't need to. This mod is so powerful. The stealth missions are impossible to lose. Oh my god! 
Oh, that was a one shot. Yo. Uh, here. Let me introduce you to a friend. Alright, why don't you come over here? And then, um, you guys come over here. Oh, they're already dead. Oh my god! And so you'll notice. Fuck! That nobody even saw me. I've been here for four months. Is someone there? Alright. Quick smoke grenade. Where's the smoke? Okay, quick smoke grenade. Fluttershy's got him. Quick smoke grenade. Oh, that's a lot. I think this is less of a stealth mission than I thought. Okay, actually we're good. Oh my god. I have not attacked. I have not healed. I don't need to. Have a unit? There you go, buddy. I really need to heal, actually. Oh, they got a chicken. Okay, this is the final room. Uh, I need something to distract these guys. Where's the lizard? Oh, here's a lizard. There's no need to do anything rash. I was going to tell Mercer about everything. I'm being shot, but as long as I continue to have the conversation, Mercer doesn't have to know. I think there's stuff going on in the background. Name of the person you want is Carlia. You say like that name like I should know it. Okay. Where's Kalai now? I don't know. Take the estate deed as proof, and we're good. Somehow I had a conversation with him. I am almost out of health. Um, so do I have to leave now? Oh my god. Uh, I just need... So I need to sneak. I hear a lot of stuff happening. <laughs> oh wait, I can't attack, I can't attack. I can't go through these. I have to go around the mammoths. Oh my god. Okay, it's a friendly cow. Ah, ah. If I get the fuck out of here, I'm good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here, have a friend. Oh, there's a rabbit. Here, have a bear. How do I get up? That was sick. That was so badass. And that whole place is full of bears and mammoths now. I was here! And now, we get out of Dodge, go back to Riften.
This is a good time to celebrate. Hold on. Who said they had the person? On your Skyrim dungeon with voice commands. Someone on Fawny said I was here. Hey, this is Doug Doug, where we saw FBI open up. Okay, we have to. <laughs> Wait, somebody said I was here here. So many people said I was here. There's a lot of people who said this. Alright, who's the first one? Okay, I kill him. No SX cats. <laughs> Wait, no SX cats. Are you here right now? No, 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 no. Is that the first one? Is No Sex Cats the first one? It has to be the first person to say it. He did it. I was here. It's Noah Sex Cats. Noah Sex Cats did it. <laughs> it needs to, I want it to feel genuine. I'm not trying to be a dick. But just like... How do you how do you just be like, dude, fuck yeah, like I'm so happy for you, man. Like, what's the wording there? It's got it's it gotta be like pumped up, you know? Oh, was there? Okay, I'll go with the, the first. Dog cheese hijacked this so fast that everyone forgot about man. Hashtag justice for me more, so I was here. I was here for you, man. Add the timestamp. Uh, what do you? Okay, cool. He was here. Oh yeah, that's not even the right timestamp. And that's the mission. Completely beat without doing anything this mod makes the thieves guild easy go to google trends and search for dog cheese ss cats yo ss cats you here ss cats you were here let's go you're here you are here God, I'm fucking stoked for you! Alright, 
that with it. Something about Kalaya. If only she knew where we was. You were here, Cody. You've been here. Completed. How do I leave? Where's the exit? There we go. All right. I have to go there? You know, there is one very fast way to get here. I wasn't here for the last four hours and 36 minutes. What did I miss? Bro, you are here right now. Are you doing attendance? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every time you say I was here, you're just signing up for attendance. Um, There's not even that much more dog cheese search than before. Really? I thought we would have spiked the dog cheese interest on Google Trends. Need to search more dog cheese. Check the past hour. But we've been talking about dog cheese for like four hours. Everybody gets searching. No, I, it doesn't matter. We don't have to, like, influence Google Trends. I just I just was getting the impression from people that there's a lot of dog cheese activity on Google now. Um, check since 2004. Well, we don't really care what's happened in dog cheese history from 2004 until yesterday. I was gone for two hours and we're still at dog cheese. No. We're done talking about do dog cheese. Okay, we're just seeing if there were trends about dog cheese. That's it. Do worldwide dog cheese. Yeah, interesting. No, let, let's move on. So, I gotta get to snow. I wanna do one more mission, but we'll crank up the... Um, we'll crank up the uh, mod uh, craziness a little bit and see what happens. Although, first... We have to conclude Looking to stay alive? today's Might lesson. I was here, but at what cost? After the events of today's Skyrim lesson, I think that we can definitively conclude the spawning enemies mod does make stealth missions easier. You are the best streamer I've had the displeasure of watching. Keep up the great work. Assuming nobody needs to stay alive. 
then it is a very, very bad mod. Overall, though, worth it. You can't conclude. I just got here. Zephyr. No, no, no. Don't worry, Zephyr. But there's still one more thing we've got to learn. And that is... Um, what happens... Here. Here, let me make a... Okay, act like you didn't see this already. But what happens if everyone spawns a unit when hit? <laughs> All right, let's mod it. Uh, we go into, so when I'm hit as the player, we spawn a random unit. And then in our dynamically I didn't even know that he did this. I have a, I have it tested where if you if, <laughs> if I hit anybody, it spawns cheese at them. Um, okay, so the it's when hit spawn random unit. Uh, do I have spawner quest? Okay. Build, build. All right. So now if the player is hit, or anybody is hit, it will spawn a random unit. I'll reload it. Is it going to crash your game? No, no, no. It'll be good. Oh my god. This is revolting. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Roach. I look like the prettiest girl at the ball. It is humane now, yeah. It's pasture raised. Will there be more plushies on sale soon? Yes, probably. I believe that's confirmed now. Alright, we've got to get to Solitude. Or, no, no, no. Winterhold. I only know one way to get there. And that's by taking the Skyrim Express. That is... That did not look good. Alright, I'm... Re <laughs> Hold on, I'm retrying that. What I want him to do is get off the horse and he starts, like, vibrating towards the top of the screen and I need to pause it right when he's, like, at the top of the screen, basically. Like, at the screen or slightly off. But what happened there is kind of jiggered around and then just like <laughs> launched himself to a different continent. So that one was a bit too much. All right. Okay. So he's about midway. Slightly off. I think I need slightly farther. rough. Oh my god, that's very fast. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, so where we're trying to land, is, <laughs> it's a little chunky, is oh, over here, okay. I think it's like right there. Like right over there. Let's check the map. Not too bad. Not too bad. But hopefully there's like a pool or something right here. All right, that was too much speed. Slightly less speed. Okay. What is happening? He's like vibrating on the horse. Oh my god! Nope, too far. No, no, no. <laughs> it... I, it like 
It moved him into a loading zone somewhere else. Okay, we're, we're just gonna forget about that. Let me play the loud music. Okay, that looks good. That looks good, that looks good. You can see he's at the top of the screen on the right. Up there. Oh, up here, right here. So now, I land beautifully into the water. You can drop items in midair. I think that only works for Netch Jelly. Actually, about correct. In the water, in the water. Let's go! I think I'm pretty close, actually. Yeah, I'm right there. That's pretty far, actually. Started here. Let's go. You were here. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to start this right now. True. Uh, how do I leave? All right, the question is, does this work in the next Good. mission? You're finally here. I've scouted the ruins, and I'm certain Carlia is still inside. But we'll have to be sneaky. Don't worry, I've taken care of it. She won't be using it to escape. Let's get moving. I want to catch her inside while she's distracted. Take the lead. I'm sorry, I was under... You're leading and I'm following. Does that just make certain you keep your eyes? The last thing I need is you blundering into a trap and warning her that we're here. That's enough of this unnecessary chatting. All right. We need to keep going. Here we go. The new mod is whenever anybody is hit, it spawns a random unit. Do you have the key, or...? They say that these ancient Nordic burial mounds are sometimes impenetrable. This one isn't too difficult. Quite simple. Getting paid tomorrow lets me throw some bits at you. <laughs> that seems premature. Thanks, Thumblox. Appreciate it. Not a lot of skill. That should do it. Okay. Carlia's been through here. Yeah, that's a good point. Really, I want. I don't want to use flames. It caused too many enemies. Quiet. Chain over there and watch out for the spikes. It's like Carlia reset all of the traps. Uh oh. Okay. Mercer for him immediately. Mercer for him immediately.
Hey, it works! Oh, I'm only back here. Wait, I'm back with these wolves? <laughs> Shit! Um, so, this is fine. I think we can conclude that this mod still helps with stealth missions. And see, they're so distracted! <laughs> they're not even paying attention to me! This ex this um this escalates very quickly. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> All right, and now with this smoke bomb, I can make my escape, and no one's the wiser. Move my mouse. My mouse is not on screen anymore. I can't. Okay, control out delete work. I get gone, get gone, get gone, get. Yeah, get this over to Microsoft. Well. I feel like we learned a lot. Thanks for coming to this class today, everybody. Be sure to turn in your essays. Now, which dog would make the most flavorful dog cheese? Doug, question. Will you be performing any hypothesis testing and are you going to publish your findings in the Journal of Dog Cheese? Uh, not until dogcheese.com is up and running. See DM and Twitch. Oh, yeah, Hostel Nazim. Well, I... Oh, this is set relationship rank. No, I... Changing its faction. No, I think this would cause issues. I'll, I won't do it, because we had Nazim in there already. I think it's fine. Um, yep, yeah, that's it. Thanks for hanging out today, everybody. I think that's going to be it. Oh, don't forget dog cheese. What, you mean like... Is there a dog in Riverwood? I'm afraid not, or in uh, White Run, I mean? I don't think there is, right? There is? Oh, oops. Yeah, in Riverwood there is.
It's true! You can make dog cheese! Why did he die? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay. Alright, we're done. We're done. That's it. Uh, fun stream. Uh, I had a great time. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Uh, we'll do more Skyrim challenges in the future. Got more mods to do. Up too late. Thank you for the gifted sub. Appreciate it. Thank you, everybody, for... Uh, there's a lot of subs and support today. Appreciate it. And you were here. Every one of you. You know what I could also do is... Um, Anytime anybody is hit. Now I'm calling it. That's it. Bye, everybody. I don't know when the next stream will be. Uh, hopefully soon-ish. Just kind of depends on uh, how my schedule ends up. It's been all over the place recently. Uh, but as soon as I'm able to... Oh, my God. <laughs> Why? Just got here, I'm late. Uh, no. No, detention's ending. Uh, yeah. Stream whenever um, I can next. Probably do a chill GTA 5 stream of some kind. And then hopefully finally doing the apology video. I really, I know I need to do that on stream soon. Uh, so hopefully soon. All right. Bye, everybody. See you next time.